Hello and welcome to my first ever Let's Play video. I decided to wait until I hit 100,000 subscribers before I delved into content like this because traditionally it's not the best way to grow a channel. But I'm excited to jump back into some of these classics from the past and uh, hopefully I can complete this playthrough in one video, but maybe two depending on how long it takes. And the goal of this video is to just relax and enjoy the game. I won't be talking your ear off like I do during a live stream, but I will be talking a little bit. So without further ado, let's jump into Fable Anniversary Edition. The remake or remaster, should I say, or re-release actually is kind of the correct title here of the classic Fable 1 from 2004. Let's go. I'm going to play on the chicken difficulty, which is the original difficulty. I usually play games on their hardest difficulty, but for let's play purposes, I don't want to have to redo combat encounters five times. So we'll just enjoy the story and uh, hopefully it'll be a little bit challenging. Deep in the forest of Albion lay the small town of Oakvale, unchanged by time and untouched by the sword. Here lived a boy and his family, a boy dreaming of greatness, of one day being a hero. Sometimes he imagined himself as a noble knight or a powerful wizard. And other times, he dreamt he'd be an evil warrior. But in all his dreams of greatness, he could not possibly imagine the power of the destiny that lay before him. Come on, wake up. Daydreaming again, were you? Just like your mother, mind always wandering. Well, let it wander off to find your sister, will you? She's out playing by the Barrowfield's gate. Remember, you haven't given her a birthday present yet. Don't tell me you forgot to get her one. Well, I'm not bailing you out this time, son. Hmm. I tell you what, I'll give you a gold piece for each good deed you do around Oakvale. That should be enough to buy her a present. Now, get moving and stay out of trouble. You got it, Pa. Talk to the people marked on your map with a green dot. They have something interesting to say and will highlight green when you approach them. Unfortunately, the movement with the Anniversary Edition is uh, a little clunky, which is a big letdown considering that the Anniversary Edition came out in 2014 or 15. Um, so I'm not sure I'd recommend everybody buy this game. Uh, really unfortunate that they couldn't fix it up a little bit. <laughs> Stuffing needs changing today, and I can't find her. She's a lovely little furry bear with a blue patch on her back. Okay, we'll keep an eye out for Rosie. Oh. If your wife finds us. If your wife finds us. Wife. I left her doing the laundry. <laughs> oh, come now, my little sand goose. Uh, sir? Ma'am? Yes. What? Uh, I, I was just, um, I, I've never even met this woman. Who is she? Look, Sonny, keep your mouth shut about this, right? My wife's at home with our little ones, and I'm supposed to be working. Mm. But a man should be entitled to do what he likes, don't you think? Tell you what. If you keep this little secret, I'll give you a gold piece. Oh, a gold piece, you say? Hmm. Will you take his bribe and commit a bad deed? Beware, gossip travels very quickly in Oakvale. So I'm not sure where I want to fall on the morality spectrum with this game. But I do need that gold piece right now for my sister. So maybe I'll let adults do what adults do. Good lad. Here, have this gold piece. My advice to you... Don't get tied down to one woman. Look okay. after yourself. Forget everyone else. 
You have committed your first bad deed. I love you more than any of the others. Okay, you guys do you. I just want my gold right now. I'm a kid. I can't be. I can't be getting involved in adult, uh, adult affairs, literally. I don't think I can run or. Let me check my controls real fast. Control options: Fable Two, Three, Inspired, or we can go traditional. Um, run is B on the traditional. I think I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go traditional. Yeah see what that changes there we go now I can sprint around okay let's go down into town okay. testing out my buttons here birthday gift get your sister a birthday present current objective by doing good or bad deeds earn enough gold to buy your sister a birthday present okay We have our logbook. All right, so our quest marker is showing our father. Okay, so let me go back down here. It's gonna take me a little while to uh, get used to the controls and understand how everything works. Hello, lad. I'm a trader. I wander the world, buying and selling wares, especially to find folk like your good self. Some little girl I saw said you have a sister, and it's her birthday. And it seems you haven't got her a present yet. It just so happens that I have a rather nice box of sweets here. Guaranteed to put a smile on any sister's face for only three gold pieces. I'm afraid you seem to be short of funds, Sonny. Just three gold coins is all I ask, and your sister will love them. Remember, your father will give you money if he hears good reports about you. Hmm. There are other ways to make gold, too. Trade goods! Right, got you, you little ruffian! Uh-oh. I've heard reports that you've been doing bad deeds. Oh, man. I feel like I'm playing Skyrim right now. Accessory to improper man and lady behavior. <laughs> that sort of behavior is not acceptable. If you were older, you'd be apprehended and fined by the town guards. Really? Would you really punish a child for this? You need to decide if behaving like that is worth it, my young friend. I'll leave it at that for now. But think about what I've said. You got it, buddy. Honestly, where's that filthy layabout husband of mine? <laughs> With some woman I don't doubt. I run his house, bring up his children, and what do I get in return? Nothing. If you find him, let me know, won't you? I... I, I haven't seen him. <laughs> Off with other women, I reckon. If you do see him, you'd be doing a very good deed to let me... Yes, ma'am. I'm already Honestly, in trouble. I can't get in trouble by two people. Good for nothing husband of mine. Oh, there's our sister. I remember her being right here. I think we gotta go back this way. Find some more chores that we can do around town. Yeah, definitely a little clunky. Oh, oh, thank goodness. Listen, lad, could you do me a favor? I've got to, you know, answer a call of nature. Oh, stay here and watch this stock for me. There's a good lad. Just stand between those two stacks and don't move. I'll put a good word in for you when I get back. Right, won't be long. My cousin says that the barrels in these warehouses might have stuff in them. Does he now? Quick, while he's away, smash his barrels up and see what's inside. Unless you're too scared. Unless you're just a big blubbing girl. 
What'd you just say to me? Come on! Let's go and break stuff! It's awfully tempting. You're just gonna stand there like a lemon? It's awfully tempting. Now being good is so boring. I agree. <laughs> Isn't this more fun? Quite the mischievous child. Oh no, he's coming back. Excellent, thanks, lad. You've done me a big favor. Uh, no problem, sir. I'll let your dad know what a splendid watchman you made. <laughs> you performed a good deed. Remember, talk to your father to receive your reward. Yeah, we gotta get out of here. Immediately. Don't remember where that teddy bear is. Go check up here real fast. be able to hit characters when they have a red highlight. To attack a non-hostile character, you must lock onto them by pulling and holding left trigger. Well, you know what? I'm the only bully in this town. Why are you playing with it hurt! It hurt! <laughs> I'm sorry! I'll leave him alone! Just please don't hit me again! Thank you! You stopped him good! Thank you! You're welcome. Here, I'll let you look after Rosie. She'll be safe with you. Hey, there we go. Ooh. Okay, let's go find the little girl who needs her teddy bear. And then we'll be able to buy our sister a gift. I'm going after him. Uh oh. <laughs> the guards are coming after me again. <laughs> your stuffing oh no they're still coming after me papa mm, I'm a man of my word so here's the gold <laughs> for your good deeds little does he know but if you think that I'll turn a blind eye to your mischief you're very wrong look try to keep out of trouble please for me well I think you may have enough there, son. Have you spoken to the trader? You now have enough money to buy a present for your sister. The gold symbol on your map shows the location of the person, object, or place you should go to next. Oh, no. What? You again? I'm hearing of your mischief rather regularly. Shall we remind ourselves? Could you keep it down a little? My dad's right over here next to us. Destruction of a person's vendables. Accessory to improper man and lady behavior. Yes, guilty. Do you realize the trouble you'd be in if you weren't such a little un? Fortunately, I am a little un. Now go and keep yourself out of trouble. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Stock. Ooh, you're lucky I've still got these sweets. Quickly, give me three gold pieces now, and they're yours. Young sir, they are yours. Wish your sister a happy birthday from me now, won't you? Chocolates. Who can resist such sweetmeats? All right, let's go find our sister. Not sure if there's anything else I can do around Get here. Your miscellaneous items here. You know what? I wonder if I could should tell her right now. I'm starting to change my ways. After that guard talked to me, I learned my lesson. Where's that filthy layabout? <laughs> With some woman I run his hat. If you find him, let You have? Right. I'm gonna turn him into balverine food. <laughs> Thank you, young sir, for telling me. You're welcome. 
Okay, let's go back to my father real fast. Maybe he'll give me one more gold coin. Wait till I, get my hands I am on causing pig. chaos in this town right now. And I'm quite enjoying it. I might actually have to follow her. This is going to be quite entertaining. <laughs> Yo, filthy swine! Uh-oh. I ought to chop them right off. You know I only have eyes for you, my sweet. Don't insult me anymore! My mother was right about you! Well, if you think I'm going to cook and clean for you while you're out having a good time with your strumpet, you've got another thing coming! We were rehearsing a play. Yeah, that's all it was. Who is she anyway? Some tart from the village? <sighs> Younger than me, is she? We were rehearsing a play. <laughs> yeah, that's all it was. Yo, filthy swine! A play. I ought to chop them right off. Okay. Don't insult me anymore. My Great voice acting. Right oh, I can't. Oh, so oh my God! Sorry about that, Dad. It's Fable. I have to do it at least once. Okay, let's go find Sister. Good day, Mr. Guard. Hello, little brother. I hope you haven't forgotten what day it is, like you did last year. <laughs> I'm sorry if I woke you up last night. It was another of those dreams. I was standing in this field when something happened, but I can't remember what. Never mind that, though. I'm still waiting for my present. I knew you were going to bring me chocolates. It's just like my dream. Come on, let's go home. Mother will be back for my party any minute now. Wait, there's something wrong. Bandits! Classic scene. What's really happening? They're here. You've got to hide. Got one. Oh, wow. Fable is no joke. Evil had come to Oakvale. Bandits wielding torches and steel, slaying and burning all in their path. Blood-red flames lit the night as the villagers screamed and begged for mercy. And soon, their bodies filled the streets. Then the raiders reached the last house, where the boy and his family lived. It was them they had slaughtered so many to find. The father fought to protect his kin, but he was no warrior, and fell mortally wounded. The bandits ripped the house apart, but could not find the boy. Through torture and threats, his mother and sister remained silent, and their furious attackers took them both. From the nearby woods, the boy watched as all he knew was taken away. His whole life was crushed to ashes. He was alone. Excellent voice acting. And great cutscenes. Or excellent narration, should I say. Papa? Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
We must leave. It's not safe here. They're all dead. You don't want to join them, do you? Then give me your hand. We have no choice. Hmm. I thought you'd have a stronger stomach than that. Come on. Save your energy, boy. It's not me you want to fight. You might not realize it, but I just saved your life. There's nothing left for you in Oakvale. And if you'd stayed, you'd be as dead as the rest of them. Come with me. My name is Maze, and I'm the head of the Guild of Heroes. You must have heard of it. You'll find nowhere safer in all of Albion, nor a better place to call your home. And if it's vengeance you want, you'll need the training only we can offer. Here we are. I'll introduce you to the Guildmaster. He'll be your guide from now on. I have a new student for you. Put him in the dorm upstairs with the girl. You don't look much like hero material to me, but Maze knows what he's doing, I suppose. Well, follow me then. I love the background choirs. You'll be sharing this room with Whisper, one of our brightest young pupils. She's playing in the woods right now, but you'll meet her in the morning. For now, you should get some sleep. Your training starts tomorrow. Ah, uh, yes, Whisper. <laughs> It's time to wake up. You must be my roommate. Hmm. Shorter than I expected. My name's Whisper. I've been here for a month. Had the room to myself till now, too. But that's all right. You know you talk in your sleep. Sounded like a bad nightmare. Happens to a lot the first week. Some don't even last that long. You won't either if you don't get moving. The Guildmaster is waiting for us in the map room. You don't want to be late on your first day. Follow me. The rivalry begins. Hmm. Looks like the Guildmaster got tired of waiting for you. He's probably at the training grounds across the river. Let's go. Okay. Epic Feast Hall. Take it all in. Excuse me. It feels so good to play some of these nostalgic classic games. And just see the scenery once again and hear the music. You've finally prized yourself from your. All right, lad. It's time to see if you've any potential. Get in the ring. Now then, I want you to hit that dummy as hard as you can. Just keep going till I tell you to stop. Not making much of an impact there, are you? Here, try with this. Stick. Combat feels pretty good. 
It's the general movement ah, that's clunky. Now that's more like it. When you destroy an enemy like this dummy, it drops an experience orb. These orbs contain the knowledge gained from killing the creature. It's very important that you collect these orbs, or you won't learn anything. Now pick it up. Okay. Well done, lad. Now then, tomorrow we'll... That's the guild alarm. Sounds like there might be something loose in the woods. This is a good opportunity to test your spirit. I'll wait for you at the guild woods entrance while you deal with the problem. Once you're done, we can talk about starting your training. Kill the beetles infesting the guild woods. 20 gold. Oh, I forgot about boasts. It's a big part of Fable. You started a new quest, adding a quest card to your inventory. Details of your current objectives can be seen at any time by pressing... Use the markers on your map to guide you through the quest. Okay, remain at the guild, learning the abilities you have you need to graduate as a hero. Kill the beetles infesting the guild woods. Loading times are extremely fast, which is nice. I'll probably edit out a few scenes in this game. Well, not actual scenes, but if I'm trying to figure out something. Or there's like a really boring side quest or something, I'll probably edit those out. But for the most part, it's going to go through the game together. Okay, we got some red marks on the map here. Beetles. Well done, child. Well done. A warrior in the making. I'm not sure if I want how I want to build this character. I'm not sure in terms of morality, nor in terms of uh, weapon choice. Good or work, magic. Lad. Those beetles can be a damn nuisance. Here, I think you've earned yourself some pocket money for that. Thank you, sir. If you want more gold, I'm sure the servants could use your help with something. Or you can get an early night. Alright, let's begin our apprentice training. The guild was now the boy's life. The memory of the Oakvale flames still scorched his mind. But soon he had no thought other than training. And he became stronger and more agile with every passing year. His days were filled with grueling exercises. The nights with study in the library. Finally, he was ready to become a guild apprentice, just as Mays had foreseen. The real training was about to begin. Get out of bed, lazy bones. We were supposed to meet the guildmaster on the other side of the river, but that was an hour ago. We better get going. Race you there. We're a teenager now. Oh crap. Uh, three. Two, aha, it's you. Oh no, I'm going, oh no, I went the wrong way. No, I didn't, I didn't. Okay, I'm okay. Yes, I did. I went out the back way. Oh, I totally lost this race and I deserve it because I cheated. Oh no, oh no. It's Whisper's lucky day. I learned my lesson. Thou shall not cheat. Oh, maybe I'm gonna win actually. Late again. 
You do seem to have a problem getting up, lad. You can put that old stick away. We'll begin training with real weapons now. Get used to the weight of this sword, and let's see if you can hit Whisper with it. Come on then, let's see what you've got, farm boy. Let's go, Whisper. Hey. How did that get through? Is that the best you've got? Now pay attention. What I'm about to teach you could well save your life one day. The life of a hero is a dangerous one, and you must learn to block your enemy's attacks if you expect to live long. Whisper will try to hit you, but you can block her attacks with your sword. Not all blows can be blocked, but you should be able to handle anything Whisper can throw at you. Damn it! How did you stop that? The trolls feel so weird. <laughs> well done. Now let's see if you can combine attack and defense. The gladiator has arrived. Ah, oh, hello, Thunder. Come to check on your sister's progress, have you? You could say that. Whisper told me you've got her training with some farm boy. Would you just Maze say, big man? Thinks the boy has great potential. Enough to keep up with my Whisper. Ha! <laughs> well, why don't we see? Whisper and the boy are just working on their melee skills now. All right, children. Let's see who has learnt the most in their training. This will be a no holes barred duel, just like your final melee test. Prepare yourselves. Oh. I think I'm getting the hang of it. That's all wrong, Whisper. You need to practice more. That's what I Shame thought, you Thunder. couldn't see me fight in the arena. You might have learned a thing or two. Why don't you Keep come in here, Thunder? If you want to go there yourself one day. I could have beaten him if you hadn't stopped us. We have few enough heroes as it is, without the two of you tearing each other apart in training. Speaking of which, meet me as I make my way to the archery range, when you're ready to continue your lessons. Oh, and about your melee performance. Excellent. Fight like that in your melee exam, and you'll do well. Then meet me by the archery range to continue your training. This was one of the first games where you got to watch your character age and uh, transform according to your actions. I remember it being like the coolest thing back in the early 2000s. I mean, I'm sure there were games like that in the 90s, but this is like one of the first mainstream console Any games that allowed for, you know, true player agency and permutations. Are you ready for your archery training? Let's continue our training with the bow. To begin with, see if you can hit the three stationary targets and put some effort into it. The longer you pull back your bowstring, the more damage you will cause. But make sure you stay within the circle. Okay. And I am playing on PC right now. I'm not sure if I mentioned that. First, in the beginning of the let's play. Hope oh, it's not X for me. For me, it's square. I'm using a PlayStation 5 controller. Oh dear. Try putting the string back further for more power. Well done! You hit all the targets. Unfortunately, most foes don't stand still. So let's see how you okay. fare against moving targets. I remember my you friends talking about this game. Score as many points as you can. 
and we were all just amazed. Is worth one point. The middle one is worth three. Okay, gotcha, and the one gotcha. At the back will score you that if you do points. evil things, you start to and grow remember, horns, and it was like one of the biggest things your bowstring, the more for gaming the at the time. Calls. More damage means more points. All right, I gotcha. Come on, lad, get your bow out. <sighs> oh crap! Whoa, 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 whoa! Um, he told me how to aim, but I was talking. Now I don't know how to... Oh, crap. Things are quite, uh, glitchy. Good shooting. I think he told me how to aim. Not sure what button it is, though. I'm trying. I'm pressing everything on, right now. Get your bow out. Um... There we go. Whoa, 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 this is gonna take a little while to get used to. Oh, I see. The guild master is here. Plenty of power. Lovely. Not bad, but try firing more powerful shots. Okay. I'm going to, uh... Will this continue? Next, we will learn about the ways of the will. Yes, Speak yes. Speak to me when you're ready to continue with your training. I'll be heading to the island by the waterfalls. Okay. Right, let me pull out that bow again and make sure I know how to do this, so... L2 is the lock on. And L3 is to aim. I'm not sure. Oh, yeah, there you go. That's how you zoom. Okay. Wow. Try to shoot this back target real fast. Okay. Princes want to practice melee combat? No, sir. There's just the will left to look. It's time to learn about will powers. We'll begin by striking these strong dummies with lightning. All right, let's see what you've got. It. See how many you can hit in half a minute. Only attack dummies that are facing the center of the island. You won't get any points for hitting one on the back. You will only waste valuable mana. Using your willpowers depletes your mana, and once used, it takes time to replenish. not want to uh, hang out here, madame. <laughs> Excellent use of magic. Well done. Very good, lad. You have learnt the three hero disciplines. We can now move on to your final test if you're ready. Or you can spend some more time exploring the guild. I believe Whisper is about to go into the guild woods, if you wish to join her. Okay, yeah, we'll go play with Very Whisper. Well. I'll be in the map room. Do a little side activity so I can get used to the controls here.
You've just discovered a demon door. These ancient guardians were built to protect all manner of secrets. If you can satisfy a demon door, it may choose to let you through. Your path is dark. Oh, okay. Only a light will reveal it, and you are not bright enough. <laughs> Excuse me? The path is dark. Your path is dark. Only a light will reveal it. And okay, so we need something to light things up here. Maybe I'm maybe I'm simply not bright enough. Any princes want to practice melee combat? Let's go, Whisper. The beetle nest is just at the top of the Wait. Did you hear that? It's coming from over there. Bandits. If only we could get across that stream. I know. Why don't you use your bow? Or some of that lightning the guildmaster taught you? I'll heal you if you get hurt. Okay. Whoa, wrong target. Did you see the look on their faces? Wait till the guildmaster hears about this. Ooh, ooh. If I can get those XP orbs to come over here. It wants to come over, just doesn't know how to get over here. I don't think I can go over there, can I? No, it doesn't look like I can over on the map. Okay. No XP for us. Hmm. To the guild master. Archery grading! Any apprentices for archery grading? Hear ye, hear ye. Chuck us over a beer, will ya? Do you wish to leave your teenage years behind and progress onto your final training? Yes. The boy mastered the skills quickly, but there was always more to learn. For years, the guild was his home, his school, and his life. But as time passed, his thoughts returned always to the world outside. The life he had lost, the family that had been torn from him. At last, only the final day of tests remained. Success would mark the end of his training. He would receive the guild seal and be free to forge his own destiny. He would become a hero. Before you graduate, there is one final test you must complete. Enter the guild woods and go to the log at the top of the hill. The test will be revealed to you there. Good luck. You got it, old man. I suppose you're wondering how you passed the final test then. By killing it's you. It's simple. 
you must defeat me, using all you've learned in your years of training. We'll begin with your sword. Hit me, if you can. Years? It was only about 20 minutes. Go on! Fight me! Come on! Good! You're quick! Very good! Now, shoot me with your bow. We'll get a headshot for the last one and actually kill him by accident. <laughs> Excellent! <laughs> and finally, cast lightning at me. That's enough. Yes. Quite impressive for a novice. Thank you. You will find real battles rather more fatal than this. But you have passed your final test. And you're ready to receive your guild seal from the guild master. Okay. Let's get out of here and start our new life. Well, this is the day, lad. I remember the first night you came to us. And look at you now. Maze's faith in you was well placed. Now come along. The graduation ceremony will take place in the Chamber of Fate, the oldest part of the guild. Let the apprentices approach. For many years now, you have worked hard to earn yourselves the title of hero. Today, that apprenticeship ends and you go out into the world to do great deeds. Deeds that will bring you the gratitude of thousands. Or strike fear into their hearts. These are dark times. The shadows of Albion are stirring and strange winds are blowing. Your choices whether they lead you down the path of good or evil, will change the face of the world. Now, take your guild seals and venture forth as heroes. Yay. Well done. It's time for you to leave us, lad. But you're still very much part of the guild. On the map table, you will find details of any quests the people of Albion wish heroes to perform. And you'll need to return often to focus all your experience into new skills. Only by doing this regularly will you advance as a hero. Step into the light and I'll show you how to do this. Physique dictates the force with which you can swing a weapon and thus the amount of damage you can cause. With greater strength also comes the ability to wield heavy weapons. The healthier you are, the more damage you can take. Your health attribute defines the length of your health bar. Toughness is your basic resistance to damage, your natural armor. The tougher you are, the less damage you will take from each blow. Physique level 1. Health level 1 and toughness level 1. I'm not sure what I want to do, so we'll start off with health. There is little else for me to teach you, but I will always be around to offer you guidance. And your guild seal will allow me to communicate with you at all times. You will also notice it flashing when you have enough experience to spend. 
I have given you a basic pack of supplies. It'll be enough for a while. Now there's a whole world for you to explore. A guild training complete. Resurrection file times two lamp and two health potions. To take a quest, interact with the map table. Core story quests are highlighted with the gold icon. Check the guild for more quests. Run back over here real fast. Aha, then we have... Ooh, very nice. So we have physique, speed, and then flame. Accuracy, Guile. It's probably really good for a archer build. In Flame level 1, blast the area surrounding the caster with a wave of fire. Fireball level 1. Battle Charge, Multi Strike, Lightning level 2, Divine Fury, Infernal Wrath. Oh, that looks so cool. Slow Time. Might have to get that when I can actually afford it. Summon. Hmm. Physical shield. Although I don't have much memory of like the specifics with this game. I remember physical shield being something that's really good for the combat multiplier. So I think I'm going to work for that. Attack spells, surround spells, physical spells, magic power. Speed affects your agility in combat, giving you a better rate of fire with your ranged weapons. Okay, we'll buy one of those. Speed level 2, accuracy level 1. It's about all I can afford at the moment. Takes some nice passive benefits. Can't go wrong with passive benefits. Wasp Menace. End the picnic area infestation. Snow Troll Attack. Your renown level is not high enough to take this quest. Okay, so we're going to take Wasp Menace. And let's go do it. Follow the arrow region exits on your map to get to the location of your quest. Your inventory contains further details of any quests you have taken. Okay. Go kill some wasps. Remember, following the gold markers on your map will lead you to your quest objective. Title Vendor. Another way to interact with people is using expressions. These simple actions and skills can be used from the D-pad in the same way as objects will appear when appropriate. New expressions are acquired through changes in alignment, renown, and in other ways. Yeah, this was just like the coolest thing back in uh, the early 2000s. Would you like to trade? Sure, yes. Fortunately, I don't have any gold, sir. What's to attack in the picnic area? Follow me! Follow Hold me. on. First, I want to... Uh, Fart hey, on this guy. Oh, it's so immature to think that's funny, but this is Fable, so the whole game is immature. Hurry. Coming, dude. Hear ye, hear ye. Kind of reminds me of the DOS 2 vendor. It's this way, please. All right, all right. Let me in. I got you. Oh, that is, this is disgusting. This is like my worst nightmare. I'm better with bees now, but when I was a kid, I was so scared of wasps. I have a lot of bad, a lot of bad memories. Thanks for saving me. I'm going to tell everyone about you. 
Stay away. What did everyone hear about this? Oh no. Houston, we have a problem. Strike down the wasps. Your bow may prove useful against the wasp queen. More wasps have spawned, but they are no match for your weapon. Satisfying. That is disgusting. You're a wizard, Harry. Thank you, thank you. Alright, wasp, queen's head, 500 gold. Zero boasts. I don't know where we can do our boasts. I can't remember. And we got the Wasp Queen head. Nice. You become more renowned. The higher your renown level, the more your presence is acknowledged, celebrated, or even feared. Wow. To increase your renown further, perform quests. Show off your quest trophies. Do as many heroic deeds as possible. All renown increases are displayed at the bottom of the screen with the head icon. You've received a new quest card. Chicken chaser, well then, mean. chicken chaser. Always thought you'd have bigger hands. <laughs> Remember to return to the guild often to level up using the experience you have acquired. Your guild seal will flash with the green symbol whenever you're ready to advance. To level up, use your guild seal to teleport back to the guild and then walk into the experience spending platform. Okay. Now this one looks promising. Oh, hello. You must be the kid Maze is always talking about. Can't imagine what he sees in you. Still, I suppose Maze knows best. But where are my manners? I'm Briar Rose. No doubt you've heard of me. Actually, no I time haven't. for autographs, I'm afraid. <laughs> I have to get to Knothole Glade for an important mission. Speaking of which, if you came for a quest card, all the best ones have gone already. I'm sure the guild can find you something to do, though. I hear the kitchens need cleaning. She reminds me a bit of a Pathfinder Maze rat, the Righteous Companion. You. He waits for you in the Barstone Tavern. The Briarstone Town, okay. Alright, let's see what I want to do here. Physical shield level one. I'm going to take that right now. Surrounds the caster with a protective aura of energy that will absorb all damage at the expense of mana until the caster has no mana remaining. Shield will be removed if the spell is cast again. Higher levels allow for absorption of more damage. Only the virtuous can master the spell? Oh, crap. Okay. I have bought it. You know what? I'm going to go ahead and buy... Level two. Are you sure you wish to un oh no, I don't want to undo it, never mind. And then I'll buy a point into accuracy. Defines your precision and ranged combat and hence the amount of damage you can cause with a ranged weapon. If I remember correctly, you're not really limited in your points. Like you can level up almost everything if you spend the time. Okay, our renown level is not high enough for that, so let me take a look at my quest log. Maze is waiting for you at Bowerstone, not Briarstone, excuse me, Tavern, which can be reached from the lookout point. 
Okay, let's go ahead and do that. Let me have a chat with him real fast. Maze is waiting for you outside the... Alright, you got it. Cullis gates provide a quick way to travel around Elvian. Once you've visited a region with a Cullis gate, you can teleport there at any time. To teleport, either walk into a Cullis gate or press the D-pad in the direction of the guild seal icon. out my shield real fast. Nice. Is it pulling mana down? Or does it only take mana when I get hit? Hmm. Have you seen your face in a mirror? It's like a breathing sack of pus. <laughs> Let's talk to these guys. Look at this filthy pile of rags. He really expects people to give him gold. Join in with the bully? No, because like I said, I'm the only bully in town. Well, if you want, I'll tell you something that'll really annoy you. Oh, to have a sword again. Get the hell out of here. Ow! You lousy heroes are all the same. Ha ha ha! Funniest thing I've seen in years. If you see that wimp again, give him another scare. The little rascal deserves it. Okay. You've earned my thanks, hero. I'm sure you'll make many friends in your travels. Perhaps we'll meet again, hero. This guy is, seems like he's like 45 and he's getting picked on by a 12-year-old. Yeah, a bully's a bully. Oh, we got a silver key for the chests. Open chests with these. You have found a silver key. Use them to open chests all over the world. The more valuable the chest, the more keys you'll need to open with it. So I think you kind of run into the uh, internal struggle over whether or not you want to use keys on a chest. Or do you want to save them for chests later on in the game that require a lot more. All right, the town of Bowerstone. I gotta say, this game is very, uh, very relaxing so far. If the movement was just a little bit better, you know, I'm getting used to it now, so it's not as bad, but it likes, it's very snappy. And not smooth. The world of Albion. Hopefully they come out with Fable 4. If you guys are enjoying this, uh, make sure to let me know below in the comments. Like I said, this is my first Let's Play video. But I'm definitely interested in doing more. And I'm also interested in uh, playing Fable 2 and 3. Didn't really play those games much, so... Oi! You're new here, aren't you? We have some rules around here that you need to know about. Bowerstone is a peaceful town. Uh, I'll have to confiscate your weapons for now. There are shops, inns, lots of different people, games, <laughs> all kinds of things. Why not pay the tavern a visit first? It's the building in front of you, just up the road from here. Oh, and keep an eye open for Lady Grey. Treat her with respect. She is the mayor, after all. I want a Have lizard a look hat. around and enjoy your stay in Bowerstone. Thank you, kind guard. You're much nicer than my uh, stay legal. The childhood guards. Okay, there's Maze right there. We'll go talk to him first. Over here. Wow. Over there. Been enjoying all the attention, have you? Yes, I heard about your encounter with the Wasp Queen. Most of Bowerstone is talking about it. But, um, you shouldn't let that kind of thing go to your head. Kind of awkward. Uh, anyway, that's not why I called you here. You see, there are dark forces gathering. 
that put your giant insect to shame. Tell me, how much do you remember of the night I took you to the guild? Of the raid on Oakvale? Not much, I wager. A most terrible night. I thought those bandits had killed your whole family, and that you were going to be next. But it seems there may have been another survivor. Your sister. No. I'm afraid it's only a rumor, and there's no way to be certain yet, but I thought you should know. And for pity's sake, boy, make sure you replace that basic equipment while you're here. Check the guild for more quests. All right, let's go find something better to wear and then maybe tour this town a little bit and head back to the guild to get our next quest. You've come to the right place. Leather chest piece. Attractiveness minus 26. Armor rating plus 66. Dark leather chest scariness plus 13. We'll go with that. And perhaps I can buy some pants too. Nope, I can't afford too much here. I, only have, I have zero gold right now. Let's see what I can sell. Villager shirt. And villager boots. And I'll pick up a pair of... Huh. I have 69 gold, but I can't buy these? I can sell one more thing. Screw it, I'm getting rid of the gloves. There we go, dark leather boots. My cousin... Alright, I'm not sure if the jeans really match the outfit here, but it'll have to do for now. Yeah. Heroes, heroes. Look like a cowboy. Yes, child? Quick! Follow me! Alright, I guess I could spare a few minutes for the children of the town. Nasty piece of work. The hell did you just say to me? Hey! <laughs> Where are we going, child? I don't got to all day. The sky is really. Oh, woe is me. My son is poorly. It's me boy. My poor little boy. We were on a picnic at Lookout Point when he found these... these strange mushrooms. The witch in Bowerstone Key says we shouldn't worry, but she needs more of the mushrooms before she can cure him. I would find them myself, but I need to look after Aldi. Please, could you help us? Of course. The sick child. A child has fallen sick in Bowerstone after eating a strange mushroom. Can you help the child get better? Talk with the witch in Bowerstone. Okay. No, don't tell me. You were sent here by an irritating young lady. The one with the comatose kid. Don't look so surprised. I am a witch, you know. I read tea leaves on Thursdays. Besides, uh, you're not the first fool she sent my way. Find me four blue mushrooms, and I can brew up an antidote. But there's no hurry. The stuff won't kill him. <laughs> The little tyke's probably having the time of his life. 
Been there, done that. Okay, I'll take a look at... Oh yeah, look at that. There's a boat down there. We'll head back. Let me explore the town just a little bit, and then we'll head back to the guild and push on with the main quest. I don't want to get distracted too much, otherwise the playthrough will be 100 hours long. What do we got up here? Beautiful building. Houses and shops can be bought if they have a sale sign outside the front door. Most buildings without owners will be available to buy. If you have the wealth, you can invest in a property and rent it out to others. Buy a marital home if you wish to get married and live there with your partner. Like some sort of school. Pretty cool. People are not too happy with my appearance right now. Do you know what I think about that? Hey! Look at your face. Oh, I just want to do. I just want to use enough vile emotions. To where everybody pisses me off, and then I go the evil path. It's kind of what I'm hoping for. Or expressions, not emotions, excuse me. Choose your path wisely, hero. An orchard farm quest awaits. Protect orchard farm or attack orchard farm? Oh, the decision of morality. Help the guards defend orchard farm or lead the bandits to the crates and cover their backs while they steal them. You know what? I think I'm going to start going down the mischievous path. The people of Bowerstone did not treat me well, and as you guys are aware, I have a troubled past. Take quest. <laughs> You just stop by over here real fast. Now I don't have to stick with this path, but I'm going to try it out a little bit here. I feel like everybody goes down the... the good path. So perhaps a let's play would be a little bit more interesting if I took... A different path. So you're going to be doing some work down at Orchard Farm, are you? I knew that was your true calling. Tell you what, I'm going to pick up the other side of this little quest and teach you how to choose better friends. I hope you've been practicing. You'll need all the experience you can get to beat me. See you later. Farm boy. Your combat experience multiplier allows you to increase the experience you earn from battles and is invisible and is visible in the upper left portion of the screen. The more damage you inflict without getting hit, the higher your multiplier becomes. Try to get your multiplier as high as possible in the following battles to maximize the experience you earn. Is 
Chicken chaser, I believe. Yes, sir. Oh, then again, I ain't met one before. I like that guy. I'll let him live. Keep zooming in by accident. Well, dang, I let that guy die. Gotta keep an eye out for those blue mushrooms, also. Very nice. Okay. Whoa, wonky camera. Entrance is closed for repairs. Please use the front gate. There you are. You ready for a bit of violence? The yes. farm's just behind this gate. Mob's here. It's gonna blow it in a moment. We're after some crates the farmer's got stored in his barn. Don't know what's in them, and I don't much care. We're just paid to do a job, so don't go asking questions. Just lead us to those crates, and we'll grab them. All right, Mob's. Let's do it. Come on, let's go. Lead the bandits to the crates and cover their backs while they steal them. Didn't do any boasts again. Cover me while I get the crate. Let's go, baby. Death. Let's move. Right in here, guys. I'll get the crate. I'll <laughs> cover you. You gonna pick up a crate too, lad? Apparently not. One out of three. Beautiful. Gotta be some more guards around here somewhere. I think I'm gonna practice with the bow the most. A dark bowman. Sounds cool. Death to evil. No, no, no. Wrong target. Oh, wrong target. Jeez. Oh, my God. I need some help. I didn't know how to... I couldn't really switch with the way my hand was on the controller. I ended up just letting go and firing. Death to evil. Dang, did I kill that guy? Maybe I'm good. Okay, one more package. Let's move. Come on over here. You know where they're at. I'll get the crate. These guys are making me want to go the uh, righteous path. Seem like they're too smart on the side of the morality spectrum. Keep forgetting to turn that off.
We got some more guys coming, but they're all the way at the end. So, you've learned some new moves, have you? Well, you're not the only one. I hope you've learned how to flourish, because that's the only way you're going to get close to me. Go on, try to hit me with a flourish. Use melee attacks to increase your combat multiplayer, and you'll earn a special flourish move. Purple glow appears on your weapon. Press the B button to perform powerful, unblockable attack. One more time. Use melee attacks to increase your combat multiplier, and you'll earn a special flourish move. When the X icon appears, and a purple glow appears on your weapon, press B. going to beat you. There we go. Damn! You beat me again! I suppose this quest is yours then. But you can't stay lucky forever, farm boy. We're bound to meet again, and I'll be ready. Please, let us go. You've got the boxes, there's nothing else. Just leave us be. Whisper Brooch, thousand gold, 440. You're now renowned enough to use the sneer expression. The sneer expression? You have reached unsung state. Let's try this one out real fast. We'll Check sign the guild it to... for more quests. Yeah. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Very nice. Okay, check the guild for more quests. Let me just see if you can... can't remember if you can, like, just break random things all over. Apparently not. It's down here. Okay, we'll use the guild crest. Trader Escort, and then Hob Killing Contest. Clear Orchard Farm of Hobbs. Maybe I'll do that real fast. Take Quest and Boast. Here we go. Okay. No protection. Okay. Without a scratch, so take no damage. Fist fighter. Don't use weapons or any aggressive magic. Kill at least ten more hobs than whisper. Hmm. I think I can do, uh... We'll do... We'll do take no damage. And... I'll leave it at that. For now. Okay, I think I have it active. Could have screwed that up, but I guess we'll find out. Hey. Okay, take no damage. Better keep the shield active as much as I can. to get 
get your combat multiplied even higher. Ooh. Oh, no, 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 no. It's gonna take me a little bit. Probably at least a couple hours to fully get used to the controls. Oh my god, I forgot about that. Look at his head on the ground. Wow. Disgusting. Yet so satisfying. <laughs> I really hope that Fable 4 is a thing. I know we saw the trailer, but they've been pretty quiet lately. Like some of the devs have been updating their Twitter posts though, so it seems it seems likely that it's gonna happen. Might just be delayed. Watch out, Mr. Scarecrow, I don't know how to cancel. Okay, there we go. Please don't hurt me. You're good, man. No, you're good, you're good, you're good. Just give me that gold. And everyone will be okay. I'm pretty sure I can take a few hits with this physical shield active, or this magical shield active, because I think it chunks away at my mana. I don't want to test it out in this fight, not with this boast. There is an important quest card of the guild for you. All right. Beautiful. You get mushrooms around here? Nope. No sound effects for the roll? Take care of these red dots. Ah, there you are. About time you showed up. I was going to start without you. I was just telling your friend here, the whole orchard's overrun with hobs. I could get rid of them myself, but it might be more fun like this. Whoever kills the most hobs gets the trophy, right? I don't care how you do it, just stick them before they drink all my scrumpy. The little sods cracked open my crate down by the river at the far end of the path. Guess that's where we should go. Race you there. Actually, I think I could have taken damage on my way to this quest. It's just when the quest starts, I believe, so... Oh, you know what? Zero out of one boasts? Wait... No, I guess I took damage already? Hmm, okay. Well, whatever. I detest those hubs! Figure it out as I go. Oh my god, I hit Whisper. <laughs> I don't even feel bad. Oh, I did have the boast going, but I just took damage from the barrel. Okay. I 
having a hard time with the targeting system. There we go. Hero, your will energy is low. What? Oh, sorry about that whisper. I'm winning. Oh shit, she's fighting a bunch of them over here. You really don't like that, do you? That multiplayer up. There we go. Seconds, nice. Well done. You really taught the hubs a lesson. They'll think twice before they try stealing from me again. Not bad. Don't think it'll be easy next time, though. I suppose the trophy is yours then. For now. Again. I've had enough of this. Maybe the guild has something more interesting for me. We'd better make a move now and check on the damage. Rewards. Hob tooth trophy. I failed my boast, unfortunately. Because I was a little bit confused. But well done. I have 1900 gold, so I could probably quickly go to. Quickly go to Bowerstone and finish my dark leather armor set. Make sure there's nothing out here. Okay, let's go. Four blue mushrooms in the land of Elbion. Okay. Still haven't seen any blue mushrooms. Hello, everybody. I have returned. Ah, there is an important quest card the guild for you. All breakages must be paid for. Chainmail helmet. Nice. Let's go with dark leather gauntlets. Yep, I'll take those. 
And we'll do dark leather pants, leggings. Can't remember if I already bought dark the boots. Yes, I did. Nice. Ah, much, much better. All breakages must be paid for. This guy sell anything else? Chainmail armor. Minus 10 in attractiveness. I think it'd be kind of cool to have that on, though. Wouldn't it? Not too worried about attractiveness. Even the traders in the Let's put it on. A chainmail helmet. Dark leather. I like it. Yeah. Nice. Trader escort. Escort the traders in Darkwood safely to Barrow Fields. Okay, we'll take that. Take another boast. See if we can get the boast going. Okay, do the quest naked. <laughs> take no damage. During this quest, all traders must survive. Let's go with the naked one. Oh, I just got my new armor, too. All right. Pretty sure I don't have to get naked until the actual quest begins. What's up, guys? Hey. What's up? Okay. Um, yeah, I don't think... Oops, wrong button. Just take a look at the map. My quest. Escort the traders in Darkwood. Safely to Barrow Fields. Okay. So. I think I can leave my armor on for now. Getting better, getting better. Got him. Oh, decapitated. Two enemies.
Yes. Any blue mushrooms around here? Nope, lots of health potions though. Oh, don't want to shoot the health potions, I want to pick them up. Very nice. The people of Albion like nothing more than hiding their treasures inside wooden chests. You'll also find a special silver key chest around the world. To open one, you'll need the correct number of silver keys. Makes me think of Zelda. Nice. Okay. Okay, now we're getting close to the quest. I think I can I have time though to get naked. <gasps> Still got a little while to go here. I love the world of Albion. Check up here real fast. Silver key. Two out of thirty. These aren't the guys I have to escort, I don't think. Just in case. Let's, uh, get in the nude. I think there's a button for no clothes. No outfit, there we go. Oh no, that's traitor. How do you get naked? Gotta be a quicker way to do this. Okay, we're naked with our UK underpants. Underpants. <laughs> And that traitor died. Ugh. Sorry about that, sir. Five silver keys for that one. That guy again. Having a hard time once I aim. Hold on, I gotta get used to this. How do I let go of the arrow? Nope, that's target. Nope. Um, okay, R2. Alright. Double arrow tattoo. Arrow tongue tattoo. Oh, that's pretty cool. Definitely got to get some tats. No, I can't get through there. Take a health potion right now, actually. spells. Oh god, I keep doing that. Simple. That was stupendous.
Some bandits have set up a toll in this region. Be careful. The bandits demand you pay a toll to pass. Make your way past the bandit toll. Okay. I think I'm good to put my clothes back on. I haven't officially started the quest yet. I haven't got to the area that I have to get to. So let's go ahead and do that. Okay, there we go. The preset for the dark leather suit. Save me some time. I hope you got the gold they want. These bandits will kill us for fun. Have your gold ready. Hey, over here. I'm afraid this path is private. It'll cost you to get through. Or we can always use your head as an ornament. I sure, I like these guys. Us. So. Unless you're wanting to end up dead, you'll hand over your shinies. No. Is that the gold? Here, give it here. I'll just, uh, be on my way. Sorry about that, sir. Anybody else? Oh no. Oh no. Freaking out, man. Freaking out, Smalls. death for who for who Where are you going? Get back here. They're running from me? What the hell are they doing? Oh, okay. Flame Augmentation. Inflicts additional damage to creatures harmed by fire. Bind this augmentation to your weapon through the weapon menu. Remember this is permanent. Weapon augmentations can be attached to some weapons to imbue them with special powers. To do this, select an augmentable weapon in your inventory and then select augmentation. Once attached, an augmentation cannot be removed. Each weapon has a limited number of slots.
great music. Interesting. Damage 30. Despite the distinguished steel and gold craftsmanship, this fine weapon has still seen much practical use. The blade is covered in scratches, and the hilt is weathered and salt-stained, indicating it probably belonged to a naval captain. Check it out. Does the same damage as my sword. And we have the augment. Let's put it on. Additional damage to creatures harmed by fire. Okay, very nice. Augmentation's flame augmentation. You can see the little flame symbol in the bottom right. Oh my god, yes. I can feel the dark side taking over. It feels so natural. Oh, one second, excuse me. Much better. This is the deal. You perform an act of great evil in my sight, and I'll pop open. Don't tempt me with a good time. An act of great evil. Are there any traitors around here? Hmm. Okay. This way first. You're now renowned enough to use the manly arm pump expression. Manly arm pump? You have reached recognized status. Let me assign that real fast. There we go. Yes! Okay, this is our teleport. Let's go back. Oh man, how long have I had that on for? Sorry if I had it. I honestly don't even know if I've had it on for... Perform an act of great evil in front of me, and I will open. Hmm. Hmm. Are these traitors coming this way? Apparently not.
simple when you know how. So you're the oh. Yes. Some respect. Yes. <laughs> well, I suppose you. Okay, to Rose Cottage, but we have to go this way. The Great Wood Caves. Huh. Okay, we're getting there. Place is quite far away. I need to see your combat multiplier get higher before I swing a jar. Okay. That's where we have to go. Pick up my gold here. I want to check this place out though real fast too. Op cave entrance. And there's a lot of hobs in here. Mushrooms in here. how easy it is to zoom in when I want to stay zoomed out. Can't pick up these blue mushrooms, never mind. Oh, 
Hero, your rule energy is low. Hero, your rule energy is low. What's that? Jeez. Whew, that was pretty crazy. A moonlit tunnel. This isn't the way I'm supposed to be going, but I've got wanderlust. I guess when you're inside, you can't zoom out with your character. Okay, we'll remember the focus chamber. Yes! We want the combat multiplayer high. It's very hard with these guys with the AoE that they do. Try it again. Hold on. That's not going to get the guy to open up. I'm almost tempted to try this again. Just go in the cave and come back out. See if I can get that combat multiplayer higher. It's good practice. Oh. Too late. Thank Avo you're here! I thought we were going to die in this hellish place! We have to get to the Barrow Fields at the other end of Darkwood. You lead the way. We'll be right behind you. The sooner we put this forest behind us, the better. There are unnatural things out there. Coming! You can use the follow and wait expression to control a party of followers. The follow icon will appear down on the D-pad when targeting someone who will follow. follow. Excuse me, I can't hear my own voice that well right now. Hold on, let me fix my headset so I can actually hear myself. There we go, that's a little better. And the wait icon when targeting a current follower, okay? Use carefully, you may be able to keep the traders out of harm's way. Watch their health closely. 
In Darkwood, you will find the Chapel of Scorm. Please the day it is there, and they will lift evil into your soul. Wait. Follow. I'm Follow. right with you. Wait. Wait. This is what being a trader is all about. Not standing. Ah, so much help. for waiting. Something bit me and left me for dead. Please, let me come with you. We can't let him follow. He's infected. He'll be eating our guts before we know it. We have sworn a trader oath. We have to help him. This isn't a good idea. Not a good idea at all. I can pay well, and there won't be any trouble. Hmm. Hmm. I'm sorry, sir. Too much of a risk. I just have to hope someone else will help me, or I won't last the day. As you can see, I'm butt naked right now. Don't got time for funny games. Okay. There we go. I wonder what happens if I just go into the next area. With them on wait. Oh, wow. We'll go check on him real fast. Follow. Lead the way! Follow. Wait. I've heard there are some Wait. great opportunities at Barrowfield. I'm quitting this lousy job. This is a nightmare. One long... Beware, traveler. I block the way to all but the most combat hardened. If you request, my guardians will test your mettle in combat. Meet their challenge, and the reward I hide is yours. Damn it, while I'm naked. I accept the door's challenge. When's the last time I saved? I see you are ready for your test. Very well. Guardians, attack! Oh no. Oh no! Naturally, I just hit it. <laughs> I failed the boast. It's almost that first death right there. Oh, my God. 
Jeez. Uh. I probably put clothes on now that I fouled the post. Your health is low. Do you have any potions or food? I have. All right, I think I'm I'm putting some freaking uh, armor on. Oh, okay. Let's go to the dark leather suit. Should help a good amount. Oh, it didn't work. Oh no 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 no. Oh that? my god. You defeated my guardians. I am knackered. Go on. Get yourself through. Wow. 
Hopefully it was worth it. If I didn't take the no protection boost, <laughs> would have been a little bit easier. Even though I failed it in the beginning, I should have put my armor on. But that's okay. That was a lot of fun. Will users dark boots? Armor rating minus eight, but plus three scariness, plus two attractiveness. Boots to leave footprints on the damned. Will users dark gloves? That's cool. Kind of like a dark mage outfit. Could check it out real fast. Really cool looking. I don't like the armor rating though. Unless I plan on doing a lot more magic, which maybe I will. Stick with the dark leather suit for now. Okay, back to the quest. Perfect present. back and get our two friends back here. Follow. Follow. Shall we go? Follow. This takes me right back to when I first became a trader. I should probably go across first, but... What the hell? We'll bring them across with me. Makes for more fun. What I wouldn't give to be in a warm. The trader camp is through the next gate. We can get healed there. Yes. We must come quickly. This takes me right back to when I first became a trader. You could probably hold off on the stories for a second, buddy. Oh. 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 Where are you, hero? I'm right here, I'm right here. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Yes, right behind you. Lead on. I'm sure we'll be there in no time. Lead the way! I'm right with you. Oh! 
I don't know about you, but I'm sticking to local trading from now on. Wait. Wait. Where are you, hero? I'm getting Doesn't look like waiting, my friend. Sorry about that. Probably shouldn't be standing there. You okay? This is a nightmare. Right, you guys stay right here. I'll go scout ahead. Dumb and Dumber don't seem to be too combat ready. I think I lost a traitor. Oh no, he's still alive. Okay, come with me. Follow. Coming! Follow. I'm right with you. Fifteen for that one, wow. We can't be very far now. Is that called again? It's called the Darkwood. Shall we go? Oh, excuse me. The Darkwood Bordello. A fine bunch of traders we are. We should be selling things, not risking our lives. We made it to the first camp. Excellent. We can stay here until you're ready to move on. Longer we can stay here, the better, as far as I'm concerned. Hello, old friend. Oh, I haven't seen you for a while. I know, I know. Lead on, on Jack. The blackjack table. Oh, I don't know, I just clicked on. How much will you bet? I'll be bet. Right. Hmm. Wanty. I don't think I could take much more of this. Double your bet and take a hit. Hmm. Let's hit for another card. Take our gold and get the hell out of here. It's been a long time since I played blackjack. Play blackjack. I don't know about you, but I'm sticking to local trading from now on. We think we can do a special offer for you, sir. I'll buy. Let's see. How many health potions do you got? Five. I'll take them all. I'll also take some of your will potions. I can probably sell 259 profit from this thing. I feel like I want to give it away as a present, though. I'm pleased to serve you. Iron katana plus two damage for 163. 
Iron Greatsword. Physique level 3 required. I have to go back to the guild and level up. Steel Longsword. I can buy that right now. Plus 15 damage. I think I'll just hold on to my weapon for now. Hmm. I could buy a new longbow, though. Oak Crossbow. Plus 50 damage. Wow. I'll take it. Dark woods and Not as cool as the longbow, but it will do. Okay, let's give our new weapons a try. I've got a feeling everything will be all right. I would imagine that Fable 4 would be completely open world. The very few instances. I would hope so. But it's not too bad because the load screens are so quick now. Wait. Wait. Anybody else want to mess with the crossbow? Yeah, that's pretty sick. Get your sharps out! Not sure if it's smart to leave them all the way back there, but... <laughs> they just hit their own guy. Follow. Lead on. Follow. I'm sure we'll be there in no time. I can't remember how clunky the movement was back in 2004. It was probably the same as it is here in the Anniversary Edition, but back then, clunkiness was just the nature of gaming. <laughs> But it's really kind of a letdown that it didn't clean that up a little bit. Okay, you guys wait. Come on up. Stay right here. Wait. 
wait. Follow. 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 I'm right with you. This takes me right back to when I first became a trader. This is a nightmare. One long, painful nightmare. Oh, this is horrible! Oh dear, this water looks most unsanitary. Increased damage caused to foes harmed by storms or lightning. So you can combo it with your magic. Tofu. I don't recognize this area. We're lost, Shut aren't up. we? We'll never get out. No, a dead end. We're doomed. You've almost. What was that? Uh oh. What? That rumbling noise? Wait. Follow. Wait. I've got a feeling everything will be all right. What'd you say about that feeling? Oh no. Oh no. I know the way from here. Follow me. Not Follow much me. further now. Not much, much further now. <laughs>
All right, we'll follow him to the end. We got a lot to explore here, though. Win. Ah, there you are. We've been expecting you. Trader's feather, twenty-eight hundred gold. And I failed another boast. Maybe I should stop boasting. Maze seeks an audience with you again. You will find him in Oakvale Tavern. It seemed rather urgent. It's a beautiful area right You've here. You've received a new quest card. Yeah, before I explore that, I'll go talk to Maze. again. Another bony adventurer seeking to plunder my riches. I'm not interested in your meager frame. Get some meat on you. I want beefy. Stop being a slave to public perception and treat yourself. Pies, meat, beer, anything, but lots of it. Eat yourself large. And you will be welcome here. That's pretty cool. If you let your character get fat, then you can get inside that secret lair. Hello. Divine Fury. Tremendously powerful spell channels the white fury of the gods, drawing huge pillars of energy from the sky and striking all within a wide radius where they stand. This formidable dark spell calls forth vortices of energy from nether realms, a portal realms beneath each victim, draining their life into the underworld. I have to get that. Slow time. This spell affects the very fabric of time itself. Hmm, okay. And drain life. That sounds nice. Oh, there's so many spells. Okay, I'm gonna do another physical shield level before I get carried away with all the spells. And then I'm also going to... Accuracy defines your precision and ranged combat, and hence the amount of damage you can cause with a ranged weapon. Hmm. Yeah, I'll go ahead and do that. And then I'll also do physique. I had a lot to level up. Let's go back to the spells. Multi-strike. Ghost Sword. This spell summons an ethereal blade from the netherworld to do battle on behalf of the caster. Wow. You know what? I think I'm going to take that, actually. Let's do it.
Can't go wrong with more health, right? Okay, big level ups. You should see Maze. I believe he has more than you. Okay, Mo Maze is at Oakvale. All right. He has more information regarding our sister. Speak to him at the tavern in Oakvale. Okay, that's right near the barrel fields, actually. I didn't realize that. Hello, hello, hello. Chicken chasing. Hey. Hey. Oh. The hell did you just say to me? <gasps> Stupid. Mm. Oh my word. <laughs> Never gets old. Hello. I remember you. We thought you died in that awful bandit raid all those years ago. So where have you been all this time? Perhaps I should take off my helm. You do remember me, don't you? I was looking for oh, Rosie, my yeah. teddy bear, just before the raid. After that day, my parents moved to Bowerstone, but I never really liked it there. Uh, are you all right? I think I lost you there for a second. Anyway, I have to go now. But it was great to see you again. Bye. Goodbye, Rosie. Over here. Ah, there you are. I thought maybe you were getting too famous to be seen round here. I'm afraid I've heard nothing more of your sister. And there's little else I can do. There is hope yet, though. A blind seeress lives among Twinblade's bandit clan. She may be able to tell you about your sister. The seeress stands next to the bandit king himself. And it's no coincidence the bandits have been doing so well lately. Have you heard of Twinblade? He was a hero once. Yes. Giant of a man. He had little patience for the guild, though. He left and brought together a dozen bandit factions. I always suspected he was behind the attack on your home. This could be your chance for revenge. The camp can't be far from here. The village is often under attack. I've left a quest card at the guild with the details. Check the guild for more quests. Okay, let's walk around Oakvale for a second to see our hometown. And then we'll head to the guild hall and accept our next next quest. Hey. Quest. All right, let's walk around our hometown of Oakvale for a second and then head back to the Guild Hall to hopefully go find Twinblade and our sister. Oh, chicken chaser. Look at the chickens run! Yes! I am all yours. 
Whoa. Hey. Okay. What's up, folks? Respect is obviously due. Ready to help? Prices vary from place to place. Excuse me. Okay, I think I've had enough of Oakvale. Follow. Go breaking any laws. Oops, what happened to my guild seal? Oh, there it is. Chicken chaser. Chicken chaser? It's nicer now he's here. The camera keeps targeting people. There we go. The sound effects for the teleport are so nostalgic. Even if you haven't played Fable, it's just uh, an old school sound. Put a point into toughness. Oh, I can do toughness level two actually as well. Oh no, I can't. Okay. Find the Cirrus in the bandit camp who might tell you about your sister, Teresa. Take no damage. I'm not familiar with the controls enough to really do that yet. Do this without killing a single bandit. That's not really part of my RP. Kill at least 24 bandits. Sure. Yes. What other expressions do I have here? Belch, giggle, fart, follow, wait, flirt, sneer, manly arm pump, tap dance, and kiss my ass. All right, let's put kiss. Matt, kiss my ass on the s up on the D pad. Yeah. And then tap dance will be... Yeah, we'll stick with that for now. <laughs> oh, that's horrible. Back to Oak Vale we go. One house for sale. Don't know if I'll be spending enough time in this playthrough to afford a house. It would be cool to, you know, do everything in this game. But for time reasons, I'm mainly focusing on the main quest. And I'm going to do a few of the side quests. I might have to cut them out of the Let's Play. Because a Let's Play can only be 12 hours long. Or one YouTube video can only be 12 hours long. And I want to fit this into one YouTube video as opposed to a bunch of them. So we'll see. So pretty. Such a vast sea and such a small man. You call me small? Often stand out here and look out to sea. My dear husband was lost to the waters years ago. He went on a fishing expedition and never came expedition? back. Expedition? <laughs> I haven't given up hope of seeing him again one day. He went on a fishing expedition? I'll keep an eye out for him, madame. Nice. You'll need to sneak past those bandits to reach their camp. If any of them see you, they'll raise the alarm and lock the gate. And if that happens, you must stay hidden for a short time before the gates reopen. Metal Gear Solid mission here. 
Sneak past the bandits and get through the gate. If you're seen, kill and wait for the gates to reopen. Oh. Okay. Kill at least 24 bandits was my mission, though. Is that part of this part of the quest? I think it is. I'm not going to worry about that. Wow, it's really hard to sneak holding it down and trying to turn and walk at the same time. Hold on one second. Let me check something. Control options, traditional stealth, click and hold. Oh, there is a click. Click, hold. The click wasn't working. Fable 2 and 3, click, click. Okay, we'll go with that. I'm going to switch the controls just for this mission. Much better, much, much better. Oh, damn it. Uh-oh, hopefully this guy doesn't come around the log. I don't think he does. Stop. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no. Intruder, oh. shut the gate! Crap. Try to get your combat mode. Oh no, I don't know my I don't know the controls for Fable 2 3 settings. Alright, at least I know how to swing the axe. That's all we need. Okay. Now we gotta wait a little bit. How do you put the axe away? I don't know. There we go. Okay, any moment now. Where the hell's the guards? Get more men out there! Okay, let's see if we can do it this time. Are they coming? There they are. Not sure if this is a good place to uh, to be at the start of this, but we're going to find out. Oh man, look at that. Oh, they like spot you and they change their path. I see what's up. I'm going for it. Oh my god, I think I did it. <laughs> I got really lucky right there. I'll take it though. Here, you heard what happened to Stern? No. What did the idiot do this time? He only lost his bloody cap in a raid. Uh, was a week before he could get back into the camp. Yeah, you can't get in unless you're in full gear these days. If you ask me, old Twin Blade's getting a bit jumpy. Don't know what's got into him. Hey, who's that? Hello. They saw me, but they're not coming? <laughs> Alright, we'll have to kill 24 bandits. There's no sense in trying to stealth this or anything. Uh, let's go back to the Fable... wrong button. Fable 1 and 2 controls. There we go. Maybe I should try out the 2-3 controls sometime. I don't want to do that in front of you guys, though. It'd be like learning the game all over. I still don't know my controls, as you guys can see. <laughs> you to death. Oh, 
Jeez. Oh, come on. They all ran the other way. Still rusty with the controls, that's for sure. I didn't even know a button to press to open up the chest. Bandit boots. Hmm, interesting. I've got to put on full bandit attire. I get enough. Hello, puppet. Bandit shirt. Okay. I do have to kill 24 bandits, though. I think I still have that bow stacked for this quest. So maybe I should just... Kill away. <laughs> Gotta work on getting my combat multiplier a bit higher. Bandit trousers. Alright, you know what? Maybe I'll put on the bandit attire just so we can test it out a little bit. Cool, man. Kind of look like a pirate. Good that they're all seeing me in combat right now, but... Your health is critical. Oh, shit. Oh, wow, that was almost my, uh, my first death. Targeting my own sword right there. 
See if I have any food. I must have a lot of food. I'll put fish on... I'll just use it. Okay, I have the full bandit attire now. Nice job, swords. Most completed. Okay, perfect. Oh, wrong button. It's not what it used to be. One was a gallant knight. His plate armor was so shiny. Probably what did my eyes in. I like the animations for this. Then there was an evil mage. Wore the darkest magical robes you ever saw. Hmm. Okay. The last was a rogue. A bandit. Bit like the chaps here. Where is the gallant knight I await? I have dark robes, but he wants the gallant knight, so... Might 
might have to get like a life drain skill or something. Be like a necromancer summon and life drain. Yeah. Twin Blades Camp. Okay, here we go. You want in? You better talk to me. We've got our bandit attire on. Perfect. Hello, mate. Nice bandit gear. Oh, I like this guy's helm. This here is our Twin mask. Blades Camp. Once you're in, you're in for good. So feel free to get changed when you're inside. Another one coming in, Joe. Open the gates. It's old. Need someone to watch your back? If you're looking for someone with real teeth, you won't find none sharper. You hiring or not? Hmm. Let's get with the violence in. When you don't need me no more, let me know. Move sure. It. Sure. Yeah. All right, let's see what these guys, if you guys are selling something over here. Dark chainmail. Oh my gosh, I think this is... Da, 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 da. This is probably to get into... The secret passage. Stone passage. We have the dark plate gauntlets. Hmm. Interesting. How much would it cost me? Oh, I can afford all this. 780, 92... Oh, 3,000. Never mind. I can't afford it. Okay, we'll just stick with the leather for now. Dark woods a dangerous place, hero. I'm pleased to serve you. Okay, let's see what we got for weapons here. Iron greatsword. I think I would like a greatsword. Steel greatsword. 713. Plus 34 damage. Obsidian longsword. Ooh, the obsidian katana. Katana's a really good weapon. At some point, Swordsmith has been persuaded to reforge this weapon. The cleaver. Obsidian axe. Mace. Pick hammer. I kind of like the pick hammer. Obsidian greatsword. I need 3,700. I wonder if I could sell enough for that, because I think I want to go with the greatsword. Let's see what I can sell. For 375. I don't think I have enough to sell here. Oh. to serve you. 535 if I sell my chest piece <laughs> for the uh, sword. We're getting there. I probably would have enough money. Oh, 500 for the resident. Ooh, hold on, hold on. All right, let's sell. Yeah, perfect. Now I have 4,200. I can buy that sword. You won't be disappointed, sir. Katana would be cool. Lightweight, too. And I'm doing, like, a leather build right now, so... Hmm. Maybe I will go with the katana. Man, the great sword, though. Hmm. Which 
choices, choices. I'm gonna take the katana. I changed my mind. It's a pretty big damage boost. Can I interest you in absolutely anything? Okay, cool. I'll get you. What can I do for This guy sell any bows that are good, hold on. Oh, this is the, uh... Ooh, I need a fishing rod. Yeah. Thank you. You won't catch many fish with swords and arrows, but use a rod over water and you'll be choking on scales and bones in no time. If you see a ripple in the water, there may be more than fish beneath the water Dark surface. Okay. Those bandits are getting more and more... Coming! <laughs> Can I help you? Ah, another mug of challenger. I haven't seen you around here before. I expect you don't even have a path to the inner sanctum yet. Tell you what, I'm feeling generous. If you can beat me at a game of Guess the Edition, you can have this spare pass. I won off some other idiot. Come back and talk to me when you're... Okay. Those bandits are getting more and more powerful. It doesn't look good. Just point the way! Hey, over here. Oh. Somebody's calling me over there. It's that guy right there. He must have a quest for me. But oh, we must speak with Twinblade. You've got to have a pass to get in here. Oh, okay. Hey, you're not going anywhere where a bandit's residence pass. There's a bloke in the tavern's got one. Practically lives there. Just point the way. <laughs> hey, over here. Okay, let's play this game. Spot the edition. To win spot the edition, you must complete several rounds in a set amount of time. Each round consists of two phases. When you feel you've memorized the objects, press A. The objects will be covered and an additional object added. When the objects are presented again, you must guess which item is new. What takes your fancy? I just bought some health potions, so now I'm running low on gold. Okay, board, mushroom board, plant board. book. I wanna kill something! Book, fish, vile, apple. Book, fish, vile, apple. Boot, statue, mushroom, sword, vile. Boot, statue, mushroom, sword, vile. Boot, statue, mushroom, sword, vile. This is getting tough. Statue, sword, key, goblin, Fish statue. Okay. Oh well, good luck, chicken chaser. Oh no. Oh no. Okay. Fish statue. Sword boot. Are we gonna spill some good um, singing on what? No, I'm out of time. Wow, that's tough. Damn. That's real tough. What was the extra one on that one? I think it was the oh, I think it was the key too. And I'm right on it right now. All I had to do was hit the A button. Okay, let's try it again. I'll bet ten again. Do this quick this time. It was nothing. Everybody's board. snoring around I me. Kill something. Is that your key boot apple? He's all, right. he is. <laughs> all the snoring. It's distracting. Vile apple statue boot key. Vile apple statue boot key. Vile apple statue boot key. 
your boot key. Took too long on that one, man. Statue wasp book vile mushroom apple. Statue wasp book like vile this. mushroom apple. Oh man, here we go. Apple, mushroom, fish, statue, white boot book. Oh my god. Not gonna lie, that one was almost a, uh... Almost a guess. Just kinda had to go with whatever popped into my head first. Board, board, board. I wanna kill something. You won with a new best score. Press A to continue. You're the first bandit I've ever seen with the brains to beat my game. In fact, are you sure you're even a bandit? Shh, shh, shh. Ah, well, never mind. I said you would win my pass if you beat me. So here it is. Thank you, thank you. The bandit camp pass. Nice. I wonder if my uh, hiree, my employee here, is going to be able to come with me to be my bodyguard. If you don't have a pass, looks like a valid pass to me. And you go. Level three. Twin Blades Elite Camp. What have we got here? How's it, going? it looks like my buddy's still with me. Perfect. An unlooted chest in a bandit camp. Yeah, right. Got a fighting arena over here. Minus 20 gold. Oh, this guy is just eating away at my gold right now. I'm going to keep him with me. Hey, Rolf. The boss told me to look after this area. He's having a party. And that includes not letting anyone through this door. Apart from the hostages providing the entertainment. And that's what I'm going to do. Got it? Huh. Got skills. What's going on, guys? Moving. Kiss my ass. Apart from the hostages. Hmm, wonder what I can do around here. Come to look at Twin Blades Entertainment. Ain't they just lovely? <laughs> Gonna be a fun party, all right. All right, I'm going to have to let this guy go. It's too expensive. <laughs> I'm finished with you, sir. Yeah, you just made like 80 gold doing nothing. The guard has the key. Get it off him. The guard has a key. Huh, okay. We'll let him come back up here. I might have to kill him. Help us! Oh. I'm coming, ladies. I'm coming. Hey. Oh. You should be. You would eat. Oh, oh my god. Thank god I missed. There we go. Gotta do a quick kill. Nice. You're Help now us. renowned enough to use the scary laugh expression. The scary laugh expression. <laughs> Thank you so much. I thought we were going to die, but we have to leave quickly before the guards notice. <laughs> they just run right through the bandit camp. Twin Blades hostages have escaped! Grab them before they get away! Now is our chance. You have reached familiar status. 
Let's see what this new expression is real fast. Scary laugh. Yes, yes, yes. I well like this a done. lot. The gate Let's is assign open. that to... You can go to Twin Blades area now. So a left D-pad, yeah. <laughs> okay. I dig it. Go through the gate into Twin Blades area. The hostages, they've escaped. They just leave the gate open into Twin Blades area. Yeah, I'm sure. I've been waiting for you. Stand back, lads. Twin Blade wants a word with this little hero. Cool. Looking tiny, Twin Blade. She said a guild puppet would come, and here you are. My blades have been dying to meet you. Blackbeard. They haven't been fed for days. You don't look like much of a meal, though. Draw your blade, killed puppet. Let's see what you're made of. You got it, little man. All right, I'm going to put on my... Uh... If I'm going to kill all the bandits, I'm going to look damn good while I'm doing it. So let's put on... Ooh, the Assassia. Get into my UK undies. I'll put on my dark... No, I'll put on my dark leather suit. Yeah. And... Chainmail helmet. Okay, who's first? Let's go, baby. Okay, I'm just fighting him. Oh, wow. They're, oh, they're cheating. I see what's up. Oh, bad start. Real bad start. Come on, I just beat Elden Ring not too long ago. His weak spot here. Oh, there it is. your own sister oh my her past once again before her Teresa's memories returned in a blaze of fire Oak Vale was burning she watched in silence as the bandits tortured her mother then turned to her with questions of the missing boy she answered them only with a stare and so their leader sliced out her eyes. The raiders took the boy's mother and left Teresa alone in the forest. There she crawled for three days, 
blind and desolate, until she was found by bandits, Twinblade and his men. She began a new life of servitude among their clan. But the bandit king sensed her exceptional strength and power of will and listened as she whispered dark prophetic truths in her sleep. Those who could never accept this small blind girl standing by their master's side did not last long. When they attacked, she killed them without mercy and without emotion. For this was her place in the world now. I've seen so many things, so much killing, so much dying. I've seen you, little brother, in a ring of sand and blood, an arena full of secrets. And I've seen the choice you'll have to make one day, between the darkness and the light. Teresa! I'm sorry, Twinblade. Your path is alone now. All our paths are. But before I leave, brother, I have a present for you. For all the birthdays I've missed. A power that runs in our family. He finds you when you're sleeping, and when the daylight fades. What are you waiting for? Finish it, or leave me alone. I'm dead anyway. I'm no one's king anymore. I don't mind if that's the way it has to be. System. Try to get my multiplier a bit higher here. Targeting's not even working right now. Broke. They're very nice. Lots of XP.
The perfect gift. I don't know if I'm going to be giving the diamond away, to be quite honest with you. I'm not sure if I missed something here or what. We killed Twin Blade. Nope. Oh, here we go. All right. I was gonna say something was wrong. Bandit blood. Kill at least 24 bandits. Perfect. We got the bandit seal. 7,400 gold. Wow. And we completed our boast. Beautiful. Now, I wonder what happens that if I... That was a very impressive victory, Hero. But Maze has more news for you at the guild. I suggest you return here at once. Guess I could, uh, just tell you You've received that a new quest card. Check the guild for more quests. You should speak to Maze. He's waiting for you in his quarters, located in the big tower at the back of the guild. Okay. Physical shield... Level 4. Yeah, perfect. Berserk. The spell sends the caster into a hulking frenzy, increasing speed and strength, while conversely decreasing reason and civilized manners. Higher levels allow the caster to become even more powerful and maintain this state for longer. Don't think I want to do... Ooh, the Assassin Rush is pretty cool, but I think I'm going to... I keep changing what I'm going to do, but I think I'm going to get into a heavier armor build now. Because the range combat's a little tough. So is stealth with the controls. Multi arrow? Damn, that sounds cool though. Magic power. Hmm. Let's see what I want to do here. Force push. That actually looks really good. Fireball also has to be really good. Fireball is good in every game. I'll just add some toughness. Can't go wrong with the basic stats. The less damage you'll take from each blow. Okay. Then we'll do some magic upgrading next. Have a chat with Maze. So, you really found your sister? <laughs> I'd never have imagined her living among bandits. You've really come a long way these last few years, haven't you? People are starting to ask when they'll see you in the arena, out in Witchwood. But before you go wandering again, I've left a quest card of my own. A favor, if you will. An old friend of mine has gone missing. Calls himself the Archaeologist. He may have stumbled onto something big. Perhaps big enough to put his life in danger. There's a rumor that he may be hiding somewhere in Witchwood. That is, if he isn't dead already. You can use a Cullis Gate to get there. I only hope it isn't too late. You got it, Maze. You've received a new quest card. If 
find the archaeologist missing in Witchwood. These are some of my side quests. Okay. Not too worried about them at the moment. Chicken chaser. I might have to change my title. Hold on, hold on. It might be time to get rid of the chicken chaser title. Please don't mess with the goods. The Liberator, Druid, Ranger. That's cool. Rune Master, come known as Hood. Robin Hood? Saber, Pie Master, Chicken Chaser, Arse Face. <laughs> oh, you know what? I'm going to do Arse Face. So that way it plays into the RP of the reason why my character gets very, very angry. Witchwood's a weird place. Horrible, really. Not sure if you have to equip those titles or how that works. Take a look at my stats real fast. Been a while. Got the up magic power too, I forgot about that. Okay. Personality, renown three, alignment minus 20, attractiveness minus 36, scariness plus 36. Familiar spell warrior called Arseface, age 25, weight slim. Nice, I respect it. Are you kidding me right now, wise guy? <laughs> Whoa! Gave me a start there. Yeah. That's what I thought. Okay, we got a bunch of side quests here. I'm gonna go ahead and go to Witchwood right now. Maybe do a few of those side quests off camera. Witchwood Cullis Gate, one of Elbion's important Cullis Gates. Teleport. The archaeologist is protected by a magical door. Find this door, all right? Rumor has it that somewhere in Witchwood there is a sword that only a true hero can acquire. A sword, you say? There is a temple in Witchwood that is supposed to give spiritual strength. Be warned. Some gods can be fickle. If they do the open world well in Fable 4, it has the potential to be one of the best RPGs of the next decade. Uh-oh. Rock Golem? Wasn't a lot of damage, was it? Oh, wow. Close. 
see how much a uh, crossbow bolt does while we charge up. 163, that's actually not bad. I gotta start giving gifts away to my faves. The Guild of Zeros. Satirical pamphlet purports to be the Journal of Zero in training. It is a thinly veiled attack on the Guild, the self claimed superiority of its members, and the cult of celebrity that surrounds them. The author disappeared shortly after its publication. Interesting. <gasps> the Witchwood Stones. Wait until you feel a bite on the hook and then press the A button. To reel in the fish and make the catch, keep pressing the A button. When the fish reaches the left side of the bar, you've caught it. Oops. Try again. Try again. <laughs> I guess fishing is not my forte. Getting tired. I like this fishing system. Just took a second to figure it out. Yeah, I got a silver key too, nice. 
I only open to those who know my name. If you know it, find and hit the magic stones to spell it out. Only one person knows my name, but I doubt you'll find him even at... Is it the archaeologist, perhaps? I think it is. Okay. <gasps> Obsidian Great Hammer. Might give that a try here shortly. Always S S I H S I H D S I H D I H D S I H D. What kind of name can we make out of that? S I H D. Let's go a little further up here. S I H D. Honestly, I'd have to write it down on a notepad in front of me to be able to think about that right now. Nice! Getting the chainmail set now. Beautiful. Sort of fight beside you. Sure. Good day, hero. Excellent. There it let's move. Let's go. Waste no time. Welcome to the Temple of Light. This is where my people come to worship me. Perhaps you will join me. Great app. I bid you need a good sort of fight beside Damn you. It. Your rewards will be slight. Sort of fight beside yeah, you. but I don't want you to follow me around all day until I'm actually ready. You hear what I'm saying? All right, now I'll hire him back. Need a good sort of fight. Good day. Excellent. Okay, let's go, buddy. Oh, the weapon. So, have you heard the legend of this sword? A knight of the old kingdom called Hugh wielded a sword like no other. He was a giant. The sword cut through monsters, people, and demons like parchment. It possessed power, power that mortals could not control. Dying, Hugh thrust it into the living rock from which it could never be removed. Legend says that only somebody as strong as Hugh the giant can remove it. Perhaps okay. it's just an old wives tale. Perhaps it's a fake. You carry the frame title, Ours Face. <laughs> you got no right. Take it start. <laughs> Space. I'll remember that. Which would lake? 
Here we go. Now we got some bandits. Power mustache. You found a hairstyle card. Use this as your nearest barber. I haven't done any of that yet. I'm ready. Excuse me, sir. Uh oh, we got a werewolf. Defend yourselves. Prepare to fight. Prepare to fight. Let's move. Space. Nice flame augmentation. I definitely got to figure out a good spell and weapon combo. Griffin tattoo. Sounds cool. Any wolf tattoos? Fire monkey tattoo? You see something? Not yet, my friend. Uh oh, here we go. Prepare to fight. Fought, champ. <laughs> As I say that, he gets decapitated by a werewolf right behind me. I hate how easy it is to zoom in. Like, I wish it would just stay out. I wish I could auto lock it out. I don't think I can, though. Control options. What is the Fable 2 and 3 inspired? Camera expand? Nope still on the same oh it's click on fable two and three maybe i really should learn the two and three inspired controls seem a little bit uh seem better stealth click and all that well i'm just starting to get used to the traditional controls i don't feel like changing oh i just changed by accident Oops. I feel like I'm at Bree right now in Middle Earth.
archery competition closed. Please come back another time. Okay. Got a lot of quests out here. Okay, I guess I'm gonna go back to that, uh... That stone. Oh, hold on, we got another one over here. If you can hurt my face with an arrow, I'll crack wide open for you. Hmm, I wonder if I need a magical arrow. Or does a bolt count? <laughs> I was just a shadow. Hey, I need you to leave, sir. I bid you f Goodbye. the power. So, I've got the gap. Awesome. The hidden cups. The Elixir of Life, a rare herbal health potion. Health potion. I said herbal health potion. A rare herbal health potion with extraordinary health boosting powers. Become more healthy than you've ever been before. I gotta start eating, like, uh, meat and stuff. My character to transform a little bit. Oh no, the werewolves are back. You know what, I can probably just teleport. Okay, so I haven't found out his name yet. I'm sure I probably missed something back... ...back in that temple area. Should have probably spoken to everybody there. Um, but let's see if we can spell out. Let me write it down. Hold on. S H I D I S H T O T. T I S H. Tish. Let's try that first. T. I S H. Tish. T I S H. Nope, that wasn't right. Um, what else can we spell it here? T I S H. How about. T I S H S T H I no S I T H Sita no H I T H I S T Hist Hist maybe H I S T H I S T-H-I-S-T Nope. Uh, H-I-S-T- H-I-T-S. Hits. H-I-T-S. H I H-I-T-S. T 
Sounds like you're saying D. H I T S. Hey, would you look at that? Hits. Nice. Kind of sounded like a uh, out my name. Halo announcer. Big deal. In you go. <laughs> Big deal. I like that you can solve that without having to get the answer from somebody. So, you found me. That's just grand. If you can find me, so can they. I should never have started studying the focus sites. But how was I to know Jack was interested in them too? Yes, Jack of Blades. Look, I have no time to explain. You can read my journal if you want. I don't want it anymore. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'll be off. It's not safe for me here anymore, thanks to you. Okay. Find the archaeologist. Complete. Chain mail leggings. Nice. I'm going to start putting that stuff on right now. See if I have the chain mail outfit. There we go. Cool. And then we'll just have to put on... That looks kind of cool. Dark leather chest, and then we'll put on... Dark leather boots. Looks alright. I think I'd like to find a different hat, though. I haven't had to use a resurrection file yet, but they're worth a lot of money. So. For more quests. Got it. Let me just check in here first for treasure. Nice. Creatures of Albion. Nymphs are ethereal yet dangerous creatures. There are three known types. Minions, mindless attacking animals bred by the Old Kingdom, wall guards for attacking intruders. Scorpions. Screamers, horrific entities caught in the netherworlds. Screamers have long struck fear into the population at night. Okay, nice. A little bit of lore. Fifteen silver keys for that. So I'd have to make note of where these uh, chests are so we could come back. Ralph was a hero who fought bravely and well, but his face showed the scars of battle, and frankly, no women would look at him. In his despair, he robbed the ancient trader barons of Greatwood and bought a house and a pile of presents to give out. Women fell at his feet, and eventually he chose a gorgeous one to marry. But too late, he realized that the type of female who is impressed by gifts and houses is too shallow to make a good bride. So Ralph decapitated her and waved her lovely head about in triumph, and the phrase trophy wife was born. Oh my god. <laughs> That's crazy. All right. Let's uh, go back to the guild. Divine Fury. Infernal Wrath. I think I gotta get this one. Portal opens beneath each victim, draining their life into the underworld. Yeah. We're gonna have to do that. But I also want slow time, drain life. Dang it, man. Right, I'm gonna go with Infernal Wrath. Right now, because it looks so cool. You can only get it to level 2, though. You now have more than three spells. To see your spells, pull the right trigger and then press the Y button to cycle through them. To recombine spells, go to the skills magic section of your inventory. Okay.
We got all of our books right here. Defend the people of Knothole Glade from the White Belverine. Take quest and boast. Do the quest naked. Take no damage. We'll go with the naked quest again. I failed that one the first time. I have to uh, complete one. And take no damage? I don't know about that right now. Not yet. <laughs> hey. Okay, back to Witchwood we go. Defend the people of Knothole Glade from the White Belverine. Do the quest naked. I'm naked. Let's see about my new spell here. Let me try it real fast. Oh, wow. That's pretty cool. What my magic power. Oh, I keep forgetting that when the naked one is no protection. Okay, well, got to remember that. I just, you know, starting to develop muscle memory for putting on my protection shield. Oh, okay, let's put on my. Chainmail suit. And we'll combine it with the dark leather. Yeah. Oh.
That's unfortunate. <laughs> the lady died while I was doing it. It's kind of a boring quest right there, but. Right. I guess it's safe to let you in now. But hurry up. There could be more of them out there. Ah, uh, yes. Bloody Balverines. In all my years as chief, I've never seen anything like it. We might have had a chance, but these damn things follow a white Balverine. Oh, it no. comes into our village and kills whoever it wants. Sir? I can hear something now. It must be attacking the warehouses at the bottom of that hill. The white Balverine. Let's go get him. Oh my god. skin is too tough even for you we had a great hunter in Knothole glade once he died fighting the last white balvary his wife still lives in one of the houses up at the top of the hill if anyone knows how to hurt that bloody thing it'll be her okay i love this village Look, like i'm at a renaissance festival Okay, let's go talk to the hunter's wife. A lot going on right now. The top of the hill. Is that this way? Looks like it. Tavern. Mead Hall. Greetings, hail, O oh hero bold. I am, you see, a famous bard. I sing you songs, you give me gold. It really isn't very hard. Let's give the bard ten gold. Let's see what I can do. Better not call me Arseface. Our man has yet to choose his path. No alignment doth him fit. Twixt good and evil lives you'll find doesn't sound like he's singing. The fence on which he sits. To the women folk of Albion, nearest and remotest, his eligibility has not gone unnoticed. <laughs> the traders sought heroic help, or on them balverines would feast. But one of them gave out a yelp. And turned into the fearsome beast. Oh, that was a waste of ten gold. fast. It's going to make for a good thumbnail for this evil playthrough. The damn thing was just waiting for you. How could it know where we were going? He was here again, wasn't he? I didn't want to hurt him, but this time he's gone too far. What the blazes are you talking about? The White Balverine. It's my husband. Uh -huh. Or it was. 
wives. He was bitten by the Barbarine he killed. And slowly, he turned into the creature he hunted for so long. For a while, he could control himself. But anything that was left of my husband is dead now. That's the town horn. It must be attacking again. My husband used silver weapons to hunt the last white Valverine. Witcher style. Please take this. End his pain. Silver augmentation. Okay. All right. I like when quests force you to do things like augment your weapon and stuff. It makes you a little bit more familiar with it. There's a lot of mechanics that I'll just ignore for the entire game, but if the game forces me to do it a little bit, then I start getting into it more. So let's go ahead and augment my sword right now. I think I'm good with having the katana have a silver augmentation. How do I do that again? I can't see, I can't even remember. Um... Let's go to, oops, wrong button, weapons, katana, augment, here we go, silver one, inflicts additional damage to creatures harmed by silver, such as Belverines and undead, bind this augmentation to your weapon, gotcha, okay, permanent. think twice before attacking us again we've got it on the run we can hurt it we can kill it fox say it lives by witchwood lake come back with its pelt and i'll reward you okay i can do that Plus three. It's a terrifying werewolf. There it is. doesn't do enough damage yet.
Oh, wrong button. These PlayStation controls, man. Not a bad fishing system. <laughs> Any news from further afield? Uh, <laughs> not nice. <laughs> not nice. All right, chaps, I gotta get going. Back to the town we go. We'd better show him some respect. Actually, I might be good. I don't think I have to go back to the town. Nope, I do. Okay. They would like to speak with me and give me my reward. Stay within the law. So, you're back. And in one piece. We heard the howling and feared the worst, but it looks like you triumphed over the beast. A hero of your stature deserves the glory of fighting in the arena. Your nomination should be waiting for you when you return to the guild. Yeah. Oh, and speaking of the guild, they sent this letter for you from your sister. Interesting. Dear brother, I have always known we were special, and now I have found proof. This book tells of a bloodline from the days of the Old Kingdom, and its connection to a sword powerful enough to rule the world. A bloodline Mother belonged to, I am certain. A bloodline you and I belong to as well. Perhaps with your eyes you will understand it better than I do. I speak to the pages, but they don't speak back. Though the old kingdom vanished centuries ago, pieces of it remain scattered throughout Albion. The guild and its magnificent... Whoa. Whoa. Can't read it that fast. It's not letting me control it. I hope it's good news. Okay. So I found the book on Google, and I'm going to read it right now because it's pretty important for the lore and story of this game. The Bloodline. Though the Old Kingdom vanished centuries ago, pieces of it remain scattered throughout Elbion. The guild in its magnificent glory ruined architectural corpses, dark and unholy secrets throbbing beneath the earth. But more survives than stone and magic, for there is still among us the living legacy of the kingdom itself, a lineage that is connected with all that made the kingdom great and somehow ended up destroying it. Whether they are descendants of Archon himself, or of the makers of the sword, or perhaps those who managed to extinguish its power, it is not known. Though generations separate them from the days of the fall, there walk today survivors of this bloodline, and an ancient power courses through their veins. They may live as heroes or they may hide among the masses, but their link to the sword wielded by Archon himself, the Sword of Eons, is confirmed in all the documents I have unearthed. If I can find the living descendants of this bloodline, I may be able to uncover what happened to the sword, and perhaps the days of the Old Kingdom can be restored. There is one to whom all the signs direct me. Though she lives a quiet life now, she has done much to mark her as the one. And now the bloodline continues through her children. A son and a daughter, and the power that lives in her will be passed on to them one day. Let's do it. The more mana, ha mana you have, the more energy you have for casting spells. Okay, so I should probably level that up right now if I'm going to start doing some more casting. Multi-arrow actually sounds really good. 
I need some more AoE. This allows the caster to trade in his magical energy for health. Cool. Earn gold and renown participating in rounds of combat at the arena. This should be interesting. I'm trying to find the best teleport location. these guys now. even in an evil playthrough to help out the merchants because the merchants keep everything going. Lord Arsface. Lord Arsface. Seems powerful. Scary. You gave me a fright. You gave me quite a scare there. <laughs> a lot would need to change before I change my mind. Can't believe that I haven't got any tickets left. You come in to spectate or participate? Participate, eh? Well, you'll need a nomination from the guild, just like everyone else. You've already got one. My apologies. You can go in any time you like. This way, please. It's arena time. Make your way into the arena in Witchwood to take part in the competition. Welcome to the Hall of Heroes. If you follow me, I'll take you to the arena preparation area. I tell you, the history of this place is wasted on the public. The arena's first heroes, our land's heritage. But do people care? Nah. People don't want history. They want the heroes of today. Still, I suppose every era needs its own heroes. Hmm. Quite profound, that. You can quote me if you like. Welcome to the Witchwood Arena. A couple of basic points first. First of all, 
I must remind you to keep your aggression for the arena itself. Anyone caught trying to cut up his rivals in here will be in trouble. You have been warned. Secondly, the way out. You can come in after each round, not during a round. Ralph, it's getting really ugly out there. All right, you, chameleon, you've heard all this before. Go on for the first round and keep the crowd happy. No problem. This will be easy. <laughs> okay, when it's your turn, I'll call your name and you will enter the arena through the door our friend Chameleon just used. Once in the arena, you will battle foes from all over Albion. Every group of creatures you defeat wins your prize money and increases the prize for the next round. The aim is to stay out there as long as you can to earn the big gold. Now, you can come back here anytime you like to buy potions or more equipment. Do this though and your price for the next round will be zero. And worse, the crowd will think you're a big loser. Real heroes get out there and stay out there. Whether you rest or not, the arena bonus prize given by Jack of Blades himself will go to whoever gets through every single round alive. So, get out there, use your skills well, make sure the crowd enjoys it, and if you have to die, do so bravely. The rest of you, wait your turn. Okay. Not the best voice acting ever, but... Ah, uh, it always feels good to be in an arena, in any RPG. Makes me think of Oblivion. Is it going all right? I want a beer. I want a beer. Wow, a hero. <coughs> Sorry about the lack of introduction. Space. We have a full stadium and I want action. I'm Wrath. I look after everything behind the scenes here. If you need any advice about fighting in the arena, come and talk to me. Oh wow. I can't let you in. Chameleon is still getting butchered. I hope you're going to put up a better fight than he is. <laughs> you can hear the crowd. This is what I live for. First thing fighters learn here. Buy potions. Lots of them. Like okay, who's game. selling the potions? The one of you guys? We well, think we can do a special offer for you, oh, sir. Oh, bright chainmail helmet, alignment modifier. Got to watch. I like the dark one, yeah. But I already have a chainmail helm, so plate chest piece. Wow, big upgrade, but costs a lot of money. Dark plate chest piece. Maybe I'll buy one of those. Dark chainmail shirt, plus 67. Hmm, plus 134. Wow. It's pretty awesome. The farmers have had stuff stolen. Weird devices they were. God. Uh, Ross, bad news. I think Chameleon's, uh, <laughs> you know, dead. What? <laughs> Already? The idiot. Right, people. It seems Chameleon only made it through three rounds before dying like a chicken in front of 5,000 people. We need a new volunteer. New man. You look ready. In you go. Talk to Al up by the door. He'll let you into the arena. Okay, let's do it. I'd like to buy a few more potions, though, if you don't mind. Hey, come here. Well, you think we can do a also, special offer for you, sir. you got any leggings for me? I don't have enough money. I could sell a bunch of stuff, though. I feel like I want the, chain, the dark chainmail helm. Let me buy that right now, and then we're going to sell. Oh, he doesn't take it. 
Okay. You've killed the legendary white. Okay, we're getting there. Play blackjack. Don't got time for that right now, sir. Just like to buy some potions, and I don't know who's going to sell me the potions. What are you waiting for? See the guard and get into the arena. Please don't mess with the goods. Or maybe this guy does. Okay, there we go. Oh my god. Bought ten potions. I might buy ten more. Nice. Farmers have had stuff um, stolen. Okay. Weird devices they were. God. Let me make sure I got these on uh, my okay. quick bar here. Potions. We want potions to be. Don't waste time. Talk to the guard and get out Oops, there. Wrong button. Potions. Health potion. Assigned to the up. Arena. There Come we go. On. And then I'm going. I'm going. I'm going. Let me just make sure I got everything else. Talk to the guard and get out there. I'm going to. Ah, oh, shit, shit, shit. I'm just going to go. I don't know if, I don't know if this is actually timed or not, but what the hell. Right. I can let you in now. You sure you're ready? Let's do it. Ah, uh, round one. They always tell me this one gives them the biggest, uh, buzz. Buzz. <laughs> That's a good one, Al. Buzz. <laughs> Funny. That's me. Like our other brave challengers, the Chuckman coming hopeful has an eye on tonight's grand prize, presented by Jack of Blade himself. And we're on to the first round. An old arena favorite, it's the Wasp Horn. Got just the spell for these guys. Three, two, one, go! Oh! Three, two, one. Oh, that's so epic! Go! Are you not entertained? Fighting like that earns 100 gold. The next round will be worth 500 gold. Let's go, baby. Your prize money so far stands at 100 gold. Do you wish to continue? Next round. He may be new to the arena, but he's got through round one. Let's see how he does with the second round. It's an audience favorite, the cruel, the smelly Hobbs. Three, two, one, go.
This is great Two, practice for the combat one, system. Go. Big boy, come here. Can you fit through here? Probably not. <laughs> Show the crowd a little bit of uh, crossbow gameplay. That's another 500 gold. 600 gold earned so far. And there's another 1,000 up for grabs <laughs> in the next round. <laughs> Your prize money so far stands at 600 gold. Do you wish to continue? Yes. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, it's time for the team oh, round. Oh, man. Who would have guessed? Two heroes side by side fighting together for their very survival. And there's been a last minute change to the hero lineup. It's the sister of arena legend Thunder. Thunder. Let's hear it for Whisper. So, the two of them together, can they defeat the Valvarine? Three, two, one, go!
brutal. Something, jeez. Oh, pull aggro for me for a second. There's another 2,000 on offer for the next round. <laughs> 1,600 gold. Do you wish to continue? Yes, I do. These two did a great job last round, ladies and gentlemen. Give them a big hand. The next round is a real favorite this year. Anyone who's braved Litchfield Graveyard recently will know what I'm talking about. It's the Undead! Good thing I have the silver augmentation. Three, two, one. Come on, Whisper, go. we can do this. 
Wow. style. Sorry about that Three, Oh my god. Two, one, go. Okay. Three hundred and thirty five damage for the headshot. Mm -hmm. That are the easiest so far. Gosh. That's it. Three. One. Two. Okay, I had to redo the entire arena, one, but we're back right about go. where I left off. Round three with the undead. I'm gonna hold back on doing the uh that spell for now. They really don't want the game to crash again. The arena, arena takes quite a while to get back to this stage. about where we left off I had to play through the entire arena again I'm gonna hold off on using that spell to avoid another crash because it takes a little while to uh, to get back to the stage but it's all good arena is pretty fun
that was worth 2,000 gold, I reckon it was. They've earned 3,600 gold, but will they stay for another round to net them another 3,000? <laughs> 3,600 gold, yes, we shall continue. The competition's hotting up. We've already lost three heroes. Well, it's time to make our surviving combatants even more nervous. It's round five, and here they are. Spared from the headsman's block, let's have a big hand for the bandits of the Black Hand Gang. Three, two. This guy have a megaphone. One, go. Not the smartest bandits in Elvia. the infernal spell. I'm so worried about it crashing again, and I better not. At least until I finish the arena. Let me try saving. I don't know if you can save. In the middle of the arena? I just tried. When I load back in, it might start me at the beginning, but that's just in case.
poor guy. Backing up. There you go. You guys got cool armor, though. For that, they banked 6,600 gold. And if that wasn't enough, another 4,000 is available for the next round. Bring it on. Let's go. We're getting rich. 6,600 gold. Our intrepid heroes have made light work of wasps, bandits, hogs, valverines, and even undead. What's next? What could possibly pose a threat to our noble combatants? Oh, ladies and gentlemen, it's round six. The mighty Earth Trolls, Ingrid and Bertha. Ingrid and Bertha. Three, two, one, go! One. The whispers over there getting hit by the blades. Whisper, what are you doing over there? The whisper just keeps getting hit. <laughs> Thunder would not be proud of this part. Oh jeez, I gotta be careful. Okay, now I'm starting to get pissed off. He's got to reprogram Whisper a little bit. Let's get her away from the spinning blades. Having fun there. Ten thousand six hundred prize money. Continue on. Things are getting very tough for our contestants. We can all see that they're feeling the strain. But what stands between our noble heroes and their winnings? Is that a pile of rubble? No, it's the Rock Trolls, Stanith, and Groin! And Baratheon. Three, two, one, go! Whisper's got to start doing his heart, man. She's not even pulling aggro over there. I would never take her on a raid in round one, that's for sure.
The other troll still has full HP. Whisper. What is she doing? Oh my god. <laughs> I might just watch this for a little while. This is this is entertaining. Okay, we'll help out. Our great hammer. Starting to act like Whisper right there. Oh, wow! Another 8,000 gold! 18,600 in the bag, and only one round to go. Is it worth dying for another 10,000? Absolutely. Eighteen thousand six hundred gold. Wow. Ladies and gentlemen, today you have seen the best of Albion's arena fighters. Put your hands together for our successful heroes. But now, round eight, the final battle. I give you Arachnox. Three, two. Bring it on. One. Okay, okay, okay. Dang. Huh, we're gonna figure out something else. That's not good. and stop that maybe I'm entirely sure
that's the time to do damage right there, I think. Got you. Good show. And that's what we're going to do. Let's go. 
Can't promise anything, Whisper. After your performance. It looked like you wanted me to die during that troll fight. to be done. But my lady, he killed Whisper. He's nothing but a... Ah, there you are. The hero they're all talking about. I'm impressed, and that doesn't happen often. But I forget my manners. I am Lady Grey, the Mayor of Bowerstone. I can see you are a man of worth. You should pay me a visit at my Bowerstone North Manor. You murdered my sister. You'll die the slowest death. Thunder, I am tired of your protests and your petty squabbles. You cling on to past glories and ridiculous family ties like an old fool. As I was saying, hero, I do hope you will accept my invitation. We have much to discuss. Absolutely. Thunder, get the hell out of my face. You are a walking corpse. I shall never rest till Whisper is avenged. That was unbelievable. I haven't seen anything like it for a long time. I'll guide you back through the Hall of Heroes. You truly deserve to stand amongst them. Thank you, thank you. I must say, you remind me of someone who fought here many years ago. Memory's not what it used to be, but I think her name was Scarlet Robe. That's right. Ever heard of her? Probably not. It was all before your time. But if you look on your right, you'll see her statue. She was the first female hero to become arena champion. <sighs> she was a fine hero, just as soft-hearted as you. But her dedication came with a price. After her final battle, she was never the same. She lives now in complete solitude, crushed by her failure to save her family long ago. And yet here you are. I knew her son would end up here one day. It's in your blood. Mother. And in your sister's too. You should bring her to me. 
What about Thunder I Sister? I so long to reunite you both with your mother. <laughs> Just think of the happiness it would bring her. This was the true face of his mother. Scarlet Robe, Slayer of Balverines. Once one of the fiercest heroes in all of Albion. Yet her most splendid battle was also to be her last. Ambushed by a dozen Balverines, Scarlet killed them all, only to fall injured and drained beside their corpses. There she would have died but for Brom, a kind and simple woodsman who tended her back to health. In time, they married and had two children, a girl and then a boy. Scarlet's days of death were forever behind her. Whatever you decide, you've earned the champion seal. People everywhere will recognize you as the winner of the arena, and it will grant you access to Bowerston North. Don't lose it. It is rather valuable. We've embarked on a path of true evil. And it feels good. Champion Seal, King Scorpion Sting, 39,000 gold. Hey, you. Teresa wants you to meet her at the Grey House. On a real note, when I was younger, I could never get myself to take the evil path in games. I know many of you guys are like that. Uh, but it's quite fun, and it's cool to see different outcomes. Just remember, everyone you kill is just a bunch of ones and zeros. I should probably change my title. Take it out of those cheeks. Well, you think we can do a special offer for you, sir? The Death Bringer. Oh my god, the Reaper, Deathbringer, Gladiator, Arrow Dodger. The Death Bringer. I think I like that. There we go. You did amazingly at the arena. Thank you, thank you, sir. The coolest games are the games where you can really RP an evil path that makes a lot of sense. Some games are just like black and white. I wanted to meet the mayor of Bowerstone. <laughs> I haven't been to Bowerstone in a long time. So let's go to Bowerstone South. If you know what I'm saying. <laughs> Oh, hello there. Oh, yes. You're well known enough to come in. Thank you, sir. Welcome to Barstone North, hero. This is a quiet district, and we like to keep it that way. We don't tolerate uncivil behavior here, so mind you don't end up in our here. holding cell. We have a raving lunatic locked up right now, but he won't be seeing many more sunrises, if you know what I mean. Now, Lady Grey desires to speak with you. You'll find her grace in the gardens outside her mansion. This is a great honor, even for a hero, so mind your manners. Reporting for duty. Coconut oil on hand. Don't try anything. Let's see what we got up here. Excuse me, excuse me. Thank you, thank you. Hello. Deathbringer. I'm pleased to serve you. Ah, uh, nothing good here. Master Longsword. Oh, we got the Master Weapons. Master Longbow. Hmm, maybe I will pick up a Master Weapon. 
Master Cleaver pick hammer. I feel like the pick hammer fits well for an evil character. You know what? Let's switch to, uh, let's do great sword. Yeah. 33,000. It's going to take almost all of my gold. But I can sell the katana. Beautiful. Arena Champion Seal. Please note that weaponry is not allowed in this town. Your new weapon will be held for you until you leave. Dark woods a dangerous place here. It seems powerful. Not nice. You are sent to us from our own. See what this is real fast. Greetings. Bookshelf. Searching through containers is a good way to find handy items. Do we want to steal from the house? I think we do. Foreign mustache. Still have to go to the barber. Adding to those evil points. Excuse me, sir. I'm not doing anything. Nice to see. Hello. I suppose you've the look of a death bringer. Hello. Oh, I don't know what to say. Thank you. Hello. Finally, someone to talk to. You've got to help me out. The mayor's having me executed. That's what happens when you start asking too many questions round here. That woman is a demon, but no one will believe me. Just because I was wrong about the guards controlling our dreams by spiking our water supplies. Her sister was an angel. Would have made a wonderful mayor. And I know Lady Grey killed her. I just know it. You watch your mouth you when you're talking about my girl. Otherwise, Bowerstone will remain in her clutches and I'll be executed. Do you want to help the prisoner investigate the death? No, I actually don't. Don't tell me they've got to you as well. I knew she was using some sort of spell to turn all heroes into half-wits. You have to fight her power. We must uncover her dark secret. Uncover it. Let's celebrate. Tear the wool from your eyes. Don't Stay be sheep. You, sir. Got to finish off this armor set. Aren't you going to talk to me? So, you're the one everyone is talking about. I must say, you have me intrigued. Yes, ma'am. Will you walk with me to the courtyard? I would so love to speak with you. It's lovely here, don't you think? But sometimes it feels like the loneliest place in the world. You see, I haven't married yet. Somehow I've never met a man worthy enough. I've always known that only someone who could conquer the arena could conquer me. Oh, wow. Perhaps you could bring me a gift from Tao. I'm sure you can find something fitting for a lady. Interesting. She wants me to conquer her. <laughs> You're so kind. I'm not collecting these, you know. You can't give me something you haven't got. It makes me wonder what I... Uh-oh. She's getting angry. I've got... Red Rose. Wedding ring. Hmm, maybe I should buy one of those right now. Much as a black rose. And I'll buy a wedding ring. I should be prepared. No better way into someone's heart than presenting them with a romantic gift. Dark woods are dangerous. Oh? 
Oh, that's beautiful. I knew you'd have a romantic soul, not like some heroes. Of course, a woman in my position can't marry into poverty. Figures. The very least one can expect is that a man will have his own Oh, house. man. Ah, <laughs> uh, okay. I'm not sure if I'll be able to afford a house. Lady Grey, maybe we shall go our separate ways. It was worth a try. All right, let's go find Teresa. Right outside of the Barrow Fields. Check out our new Master Greatsword. Augment it. Hold off on that. Nice. Looks like a Final Fantasy sword. So, you finally met Jack of Blades. I met him long ago, of course when he burned down our home and cut out my eyes. But he wasn't lying when he said he knew where Mother was. He's kept her in Bargate Prison ever since the night of the raid. I haven't been able to get inside, but the archaeologist knows of an ancient secret passage. You've met him already, haven't you? Jack's creatures are still after him, just like they're after me. Interesting. I can't stay here much longer. I've left the details in a quest card at the guild. You have to get Mother out. She's the only one who knows how to reach the sword. You did read the book I sent, didn't you? The sword is everything, and it could turn the world to nothing. Oh, and Mother has a gift for you too. More power than you can imagine. Okay. Check the guild for more quests. Ten silver keys. Fortunately, I don't have enough. A zombie with this great sword. I finished before you in the human race. Huh. Not dead, only sleeping. Buried me anyway. Unlucky. <laughs> Let me out. Hmm. Interesting.
Oh, we got a uh, secret passage down there. Let's go check it out. Guys are hard to kill. I like the katana better than the great sword. Okay. Go back to the guild. Infernal Wrath 3. Nice. 4. Summon. Wrenches a creature's soul from the netherworld to help the caster. I think I'm going to grab Drain Life. I'll give that a try. Rescue the archaeologist from Bowerstone Jail. Oh. Oh, I didn't even notice that. That guy earlier was the archaeologist. Well, now that we're not on the side of Lady Grey, she said that we're too poor. I think we can uh, take this quest. If I'm going to Bowerstone, I could do it naked just to show Lady Grey what she's missing out on. <laughs> I'm gonna do it. These guys change their mind a lot, don't they? Hooray and then boo two seconds later. I just cut the video and I went out to Witchwood and completed the Dark Plate armor set and also got myself a better bow. So now I feel a little bit better. We can push on. I hesitate to do that when I'm playing because it's quite boring to watch me go through that and figure things out for like 15 minutes, but you know, I can just cut it out, I guess, so I might as well do it. Let's go save the archaeologist. Give it. 
types of you. This is quite the beefy armor set. Rubbish! Oh no no no, okay. That isn't the archaeologist. The archaeologist is in here. That guy's awaiting execution. There were too many of them. We never stood a chance. They grabbed the archaeologist and took him up the hill there. I don't know what they're planning to do with him, but I bet it ain't going to be pretty. Oh, wow. You've got to rescue him. Quick, there isn't much time. Is that a knoll? Looks like a knoll. Minions have captured the archaeologist. Pursue and eliminate his captors to save him. I'm right behind you. All right. Naked. Just got to make sure I don't use shield by accident. Should probably take it off my hot bar. Yes. Do more damage, for sure. Not used to this great sword. Try a life drain. Oh my god, I pressed the wrong button. Oh, I knew it. I'm never gonna pass this uh, no protection post. I really should just uh, play offline for like four or five hours. You know, get the muscle memory for the controls and figure all that stuff out and then do a let's play. <laughs> Maybe I'll do that in the future. Well, in that case, how do I do life drain? Okay, there we go. So epic. You have reached famous status. Sounds like a lightsaber. I almost died. Oh shit, I'm about to die. Dude, this guy's tough. Wow. I don't know how to use the life drain. Maybe I just can't use it on this enemy? Not quite sure. Oh, okay, it's giving me life. I see how it works. That's kind of cool. Alright, let's put my equipment on because I'm getting my butt kicked right now. And then we'll add my chainmail helm. Dude. Wow. Might actually have to start blocking instead of dodging against these guys. Check out my new bow. Nice. Piercing augmentation. Nice. I don't know how long I want to stick with the great sword. Didn't really like it, so I'm hesitant to put on any augmentations right now. Reduces the effectiveness of the enemy armor. I don't have any other master weapons, so I should keep it for now because the damage is pretty good. Alright, let's take. Uh... Okay. Alright, let's go. We're the arena champion. Let's get our act together. different style this great sword much slower than the katana not used to that
Feels good. Oh. <laughs> Spoke a little too soon. The sheriff mustache. Try blocking now. So slow with the plate mail and the heavy sword. Oh my god, I just spent so much money on this bow <laughs> when I went to Witchwood. Oh well, I guess I could sell one now. Yeah, maybe I'll have to go back to chain mail and not plate mail. This is a little bit too beefy and slow. It's kind of ugly. I mean, it looks epic if it was a little bit, like, thinner. Hey, we all go through phases, right? That looks like a Kenku. The minion summoner has erected a barrier. We need to kill him. The summoner. Okay. What? Feels good when you get that final shot, though. Let's go find the summoner. Trying to switch weapons. There we go. Try to get your combat multiplier even higher. I'm trying, my man. I'm trying. Struggling right now. Trying to target those barrels, but it's really, really hard to uh, switch targets with the ranged weapons with the controls. not used to switch. Now that I have another spell, I have to hold down right trigger and then press triangle to switch back and forth between the different spells. Not used to that yet. I have drain life on Can the we second get hot a move on? The wife's making pig pie tonight. Okay, I was about to get mad at him until he said that. I've got your back!
Yeah, like I can't target the barrel. It won't even let me target it when I have an enemy targeted. Okay, life drain. Nice shot. The so barrier dark. is down. Hurry through to save the archaeologist. All right, all right, all right. I just gotta see what's up here real fast. Is that okay? The chest up here. All right, I should probably go. Oh, there might be a chest at the end of this, though. Nope, there's not. Can we get a move on? The wife's making pig pie tonight. Pig pie. Sounds delicious. Oh no. Another one of these jabronis. Let's go. No, me new pants. Bloodstain better come out. I've got your back. Yeah. Do some help here. See if the guard survives. No pig pie for him. I guess I'll have to take his place at the table. Excuse me, ma'am. Your uh, your husband's not around anymore. But about that pig pie. Kill the summoner soon. The rock guy's almost dead. Hopefully, he doesn't summon another one. You guys ready? Hurry, they've almost reached the boat. You're running out of time. to the docks. Let's get them! I've got 
Got your back! Let's get them! I've got your back! Oops. Sorry about that, sir. I'm sorry. I kind of feel bad. I'm hurt. I do believe it. Just here. Come here. Stay back. Which one of you is hurt? You know what? Wait. I want you both to return home tonight to your families. Wait. You guys stay up here. You couldn't heal. <laughs> So I actually fouled and had to do it again because I ran out of time. I'm doing it much quicker this time, using a lot of AoE. The power! Then I'd still be safely in my cave if it wasn't for you. Yes, yes, I know the way into Bargate Prison. I know everything, don't I? That's why I'm as good as dead if they find me again. Anyway, there's an ancient route into the prison through the Litchfield Graveyard. It hasn't been opened in centuries, but you'll have to figure that one out for yourself. I'm not sticking around here. I still know a few good hiding places.
Check the guild for more quests. You've received a new quest card. Check the guild for more quests. Slow time. Perhaps I should try that now. I remember using that back in the day. Perfect. Back to prison path we go. Oops. Okay, yeah, this is the right way. Those other enemies were just really annoying. The bandits aren't too bad with the great sword. Oh, I'm going the wrong way. Edsman's Hill. That's why they call it that. Creepy. my friend. <laughs> Whoa! I just walked right through the fence. Look for him. You have a house set? That must be worth a bleeding fortune. Yeah. 
I smashed open the crypt and it was all just lying there. You'd better hide it to make sure no one else steals it. Don't worry. I've got it stashed all over the yard. No one's going to find it. Not even them undead ones wandering around. Only thing I didn't manage to hide before they turned up was the helmet. It'll be all right here for now, and I'm keeping them gates locked till I can sell the lot. Shh. What was that? Someone's out there. I better go. Um, yes. <clears throat> Get out of my house, you bloody peasant. All right, I'm leaving. I just needed somewhere to sleep. You peasant. A spade. Perfect for burying or excavating. You found a spade. Use it to dig for treasures, antiques, and decomposing bodies. You can dig anywhere, but you'll find some places better for digging than others. Okay. What happens if I take this right now? Oh, hello. Uh, guild business, is it, eh? Hey? Hmm? You want to go through them old kingdom gates? I tell you, they ain't been opened for generations. They say that only Nostro the gatekeeper could open them. But old Nostro died a couple of hundred years ago, and now the secret's buried with him in his crypt. I suppose you'll be wanting access to the graveyard. Hmm. Well, let's go. Nostro's crypt is on the far side of the graveyard, over the river and up the hill. Okay. This guy's following me. You stay. Wait. Okay. <laughs> Let's rob his house. Nostril's helmet. A strange smell drifts from the helmet's interior. Its weight would snap the neck of a normal man. Uh oh, what was that? Oh! Can I wear that helmet? Let's see it. Cool. Where did he go? Hmm. Ah! Oh. Ah. Slaying the undead is actually quite fun. Silver key, nice. Pass up fishing in the graveyard. Ha! 
Nice. About time I upped my silver key gain. Stop spawning. Oh, there he is. He's clapping for me. Huh. Nostro's armor. Strong enough to withstand the harshest attack. There's a thin layer of rust that crumbles away to the touch. Whoa. Easy now, buddy. start fishing more to get these keys. Oh man. Have to try again. Nostro's shield. Sensing a pattern here. Fishing rod. My armor, my helmet, my sword, and my shield. Gather for me in the path I shall yield. I think the sword is the only thing I need right now. Beneath the horn grave? Okay. I think I saw one of them back near the start. This guy's just chilling here, man. No, I'm gonna ignore these zombies. There's a horn grave right there. Oh god. 
I see something sparkling. so fun to return to uh, games from the early 2000s. Um, Alright, let's go talk to him. Yes, I did. I'll let you through then. Be careful, though. I don't want your finger marks all over me. Okay. Looks like a wall to me. Farm some XP out here, though. Try uh slow down time. Don't have enough mana. Oh yeah, that's cool. Be super helpful. Right 
there we go, I'm back. the time to slow down? I'm not sure if I can. Doesn't look like I can. Here, come here. Okay, okay. Go, baby. Graveyard path. You've received a new quest card. Find your mother and escape from Bargate. Prison. Check the guild for more quests. Not yet, sir. I have more pressing concerns. fishing in here? Doesn't look like it.
You're now good enough to use the apologize expression. The apologize expression, okay. Wait, check it out. Let's see what's down here. Oh, great. Start running past most of these guys now. Put on my shield. Looks like there might be a chest up here. There we go. Nice. Lightning augmentation. It's a really good spell because it stuns the enemy too. Thank <laughs> you. 
Thank you, thank you. City and katana. Not as good as the master katana, but I don't think it is. I told you. Touch me again, and I'll wring your neck. Mama? Wait. I know you. No, it's a trick. You're not my son. The bastard's playing with my head. But it... It really is you, isn't it? What the hell were you thinking coming here? Don't you see you'll take us both? Never mind. We've got to get out of here. Get this damn cage open. Hmm. Mama? Can you at least give me a hug? It's not far now, but we must hurry. Mama, I got you. child of yours is quite the hero, dear Scarlet. Did you know he's being crowned arena champion? You would have been so proud of him. 
It must run in the family. That and getting locked up in one of my charming little cells. You disgusting freak. Let him go. He doesn't know anything. Oh, I think you'll find he knows a great deal. You see, the arena seal I gave him has been showing me his every movement. It has been most entertaining. Digging up graves, saving old fools, meeting with that crazy sister of his. Teresa? Yes, it appears your darling little daughter is alive too. She's told him all about the sword and that wretched bloodline of yours. And now, my sweet, you're going to tell me where the key is. Guys, you just track get yourself us. nice and comfortable there. We'll be back to get you and the other scum later. Oh, then peeing on me or we'll not? have a bit of fun. He'll enjoy it. As long as I got my UK undies, Go I'll be okay. Hell, pig. Temper, Tibbs, temper. You should keep all that energy for later. You'll need it then. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and don't try any of that funny Will stuff. It won't work in here. The boss made sure of that. Okay. Got my guy's freaking jacked, man. Hmm. Hey, you. In the cell next year. I guess you're the one they've been hot cloaker in all this time. <laughs> I could hear you squealing all the way down here, mate. Nothing to be ashamed of. They know their pain here. Wait a minute. I know who you are. You're that death bringer, ain't you? Beat the That's arena me. and chopped up that pretty little whisper into hob food, didn't you? Yes, yes, I did. Mm, you don't get your kind in here often. What'd you do? Kill a mayor? Slice up some pigs? I don't know, Warden can't believe his damn luck. God, it's his birthday today, you know. The vicious bastard. Every year, he has us dragged out of our cells, shows us a little sunshine so we know what we're missing, <laughs> and sticks us back in. Doesn't do it out of the kindness of his heart either. They race us round the courtyard and take bets on who'll win. Then the winner gets a trip to the warden's office and well, what goes on in there is too cruel to mention. Still, at least you get a good look at his place, and there's more than books and furniture in there. Okay. Lovely scum. Time to move out. It's race time, and you'd better put on a good show. Some of us have bet a lot of money on you. Win, and we like you. Lose, and you get a round in the torture chamber. That sounds fun. Yes, sounds fun. <laughs> Let me hear it. Ha! Right, you miserable sods. I want to see a dirty race. Plenty of pushing and shoving. You hear me? Okay, here we go. Now, get into positions. Three, two, one. <laughs> You're not going to win this time. Push bag. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay, I'm not supposed to go. Oh god, I'm coming in last place. <laughs> Call that running, you snail! Damn it, man! Where am I going to? Get a move on, you ugly maggot! <laughs> you <laughs> ugly Call maggot! That running, you snail! Wow, I really failed that this race. Didn't tell me where to run to. Get your finger out, this push back. Is my year. 
We're catching up to the leader. Run, Wolf, run. That way, you useless filth. Call that running, you snail. Oh, we're dominating now. Bravo. We have a winner. Guards, escort him to my office. To the warden's office. The recital office. will begin anon. Remember, I require total silence. <clears throat> the cautionary song of the jailbird. Behold, the ball, the spirited sparrow, <laughs> as it doth fly above our dreary jail. None can harm it, not even an arrow. Who said you could move? I told you, no interruptions. Now, get back. None can harm it, not even an arrow. Who said you could move? None can harm it, not even an arrow. And should you try, you would surely fail. Its tail does pour. 1483 is the code. Okay. Who said you could move? I wasn't moving. Its tail does pour forth from its beak. The diary is empty. The key must be hidden in another book. It's painfully obvious you have no interest in the arts. My lyrical opus is wasted on your Philistine ears. Back to the cell with you. No. Did I fail? Welcome to your temporary home. Oh, the God. The chamber. We're going to have some fun with you. <laughs> yeah, we're going to enjoy this. Brutal. The darkness of the cell consumed the hero's mind. And it consumed his life too. Another year would pass by in his prison. Another year of torture. The ancient noble blood in his veins, the power of the guild, none of it meant a thing inside these worlds. And all this time, Jack of Blades was free to roam Albion. The hero would not be beaten. He would be free. Uh, yeah, we got some hair. It's a special day today. You'll find out soon enough. Let's bung him in the holding cells with the others. Well, well, well. Here we are again, eh? Stay in there. And I'll get to you in a moment. You might have noticed there's a few less of you this year. <laughs> I wonder what happened to them, eh? Hey, our buddy's still here. Ha! You survived. Another year, another race. But we gotta get into the warden's office. We gotta get that key. Hello? Look lively, scum. Time to move out. It's race time. And you'd better put on a good show. Some of us have bet a lot of money on you. Win. Hey, I won last year. I can win this year. And you get around in the torture chamber. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know how it all goes. Yes. Come on, send me out. I'm going crazy. Let me hear it. All right, you know the drill. Now get into positions. Three, two, one. You're gonna, gonna win this now. time, you ugly maggot. Faster, faster. 
Should be an easy Get one this time. On, you ugly maggot. <laughs> There's only one prisoner that's coming up here right now. I think the other guys are just confused like I was the first time. This guy's tailing me, though. I wonder what happens if I just stop way, running. What would, great big what would turd. happen? Faster, faster. I have to do it again. Running, scum. Keep running, scum. Move it, move it. You again? You really are quite the athlete, aren't you? Yes, yes, I look I forward to another meeting of the minds in my office. Guards. Let's hear some poetry. The recital will begin anon. Remember, I require total silence. Okay. <clears throat> gray is the prettiest color. Oh, gray is the prettiest color. For it's in her name, her eyes, and her soul. She makes me feel ten 45 feet taller. Who said you could move? She makes me feel ten feet taller. To see her is to lose control. Come on. Yes. Yes. It's painfully obvious. You have no interest in the art. Gotta shove it in my underwear. My lyrical opus is wasted on your Philistine ears. <laughs> nice. It seems the warden has lost his key. We'll keep you in the holding cells until it turns up. Torture will be delayed. The warden only has one key. For every cell. Everybody I'm out. Free. We've got a prison uprising. You're a pal. I'm out. I can't believe it. I'll help distract the guards. Go to the courtyard. I'll help distract the guards. All right. We'll distract the guards and escape later. Let me. Prison Break. That was a good show. I remember watching that like 15 years ago. Stop. We won't stand a chance unless you get your weapons back. You need to find your equipment before we can leave. Come to rescue your old mother again, have you? Okay. Gotta find our stuff. Oh, great. Oh, great. Here we go. We'll distract the guards and escape later. Wait, wait, wait. wait. Is, this... Is there anybody in here? I gotta make sure nobody's in here. I'd feel too bad if I left somebody. Even though I'm evil. <laughs> like I'm playing like Rust or something. Small mustache, okay. Not this Vengeance room. Is Excuse me, guys. Let me at those guards. Hmm. Vengeance is mine. So this was our cell. Oh, here we go. Look at this. Plate boots. <laughs> One piece of armor. <sighs> oh, did I get all my stuff back? No, I didn't. Nope. Excuse me, guys.
will distract the guards and escape later. It's Time to get revenge. Um, where could my stuff be, man? Let's go back to my prison cell block. Come to rescue your old mother again. Oh, this is mother. Okay. We'll check the last cell on the right. Payback time. Let me let go. I got a stick at least. The guards don't want to follow me into the cells here. Okay, we're going up top. Okay. Stick is no match for a sword. There we go. Guard gloves. Guard hat. Okay, this could work in our favor. Boy. There we go. Got our belongings back, too. And this guard armor. Oh, here they come. Uh oh. Wonder what happens if I put on the guard uniform right now. Let's find out. Nope, doesn't matter. Let's go back to Mama. I'm gonna put on my dark plate armor. We'll leave the chain mail helm off for now. Quick, the lever. You let's go. Okay, come on, man. What the hell? Get him! Don't you get down here? It's not far now, but we must hurry. button. I see you. 
Just trying to make you proud, mama. Even though I pressed the wrong button. Alright, there we go, good. Get rid of that time stop spell. It's not far now, but we must hurry. It's not far now, but we must hurry. Now we gotta deal with the undead. Hopefully not. Oh, yep. Where they have to. Hey, Mom, do you know how to run? Nope. Oh, okay. She doesn't. She's one of the greatest warriors to walk out beyond. She can't fight against the undead. Can't even dodge out of the way. But we must hurry. Intruder! Watch this, Mom. I see you've been trained well. Yes, ma'am, I have. Almost out of here. What the hell? I see you've been trained well. That's not good. Oh my god, no, 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 don't shoot mom. Oh my god. Oh man, it's 
a kraken. Whoa! Looks like a bug. care of this thing. Is getting really loud during certain parts. I apologize for that. I don't know if there's a setting for that, like for individual volume. Music, sound. Um, yeah, I guess I probably could have messed with this a little bit. But like in the quiet parts, the music sounds pretty good, so... Revenge burned like a sun within the hero, and his destiny was clear. Jack had cast a shadow over the whole of his life. He had been the architect of his sister's blind suffering, and of his mother's imprisonment. And soon his power would be absolute. turn out too badly after all you did pretty well back there but there's still so much to do jack is getting closer to the sword i can feel it he needs a key to unlock the sword from its hiding place and now he knows where it is the key is in hook coast hidden in the ruins of an old abbey you have to get to it first we have one advantage he doesn't know the key will only make itself known to one of our bloodlines 
That's why we have to find your sister. As long as she's out there, Jack could use her. Open you your should eyes, go Mama. to Darkwood and investigate the portal. There must be some way of activating it. It's the only way to get to Hook Coast. But first, I have a gift for you. There's power in your blood that hasn't been tapped yet. Feels good, doesn't it? From now on, I will be able to talk to you through your guild seal. Now go. I will try to find Teresa. Can I still get a hug, ma'am? It's been a while. Kraken tooth. That was a kraken. I always love different developers' take on what a kraken should be. Your guild seal has been reactivated. Welcome back. It's been a while since I've been to the guild hall. I was in prison for a year. Find the old abbey in Hook Coast. Right, first Check we'll go back. For more quests. That's exactly what I'm going to do. You've received a new quest card. Okay, health is max. See if I can get drain life is four. I try some other spells here. Ghost, we'll get ghost sword up. Four. Okay. Got a ton of quests building up here. But I think I'm doing just fine in the main story right now. It doesn't seem like I'm outpowered or anything. She could zoom out on the map and look at it from this. What's the best spawn point for this? Probably Barrel Fields. Yeah, Barrel Fields. the river. <laughs> Got some killer fairies. <laughs> Things freak me out, man. <laughs> Activate the Colorskate colors gate to Hook Coast in Darkwood. Oh, I didn't take any boasts. You need to get to the colors gate in the middle of Darkwood. Yes, the gate will only open when its hunger for undead souls is sated. Okay.
a coast. You need to find the ruined abbey now. Ah, the music. Check out a couple of shops. I feel like I'm in Icewind Dale. Oh, it must be nighttime right now. Go to the tavern. You too, sir. I want some ale, please. Whatever is tastiest. Take a little nap. Okay. Wonder what he's been up to. Your highness. <laughs> hey, can I buy something from you? Be the tavern keeper? This guy wants to play blackjack. Should actually stop in here. Your greatness. Hello, your greatness. I'm pleased to serve you. Okay, this guy sells. Hmm. Nothing that I really want right now. Sharpening augmentation. That might be might be pretty good. Increases the damage it inflicts. Okay, yeah, I'll buy that. Cost twenty one hundred. I'll just buy one. Dark woods are Still don't want to use this. Actually, let me see what weapons he has. Maybe it's time to get rid of the great sword. Master pick hammer. You know what? Maybe I will use that. Damn, it costs a lot, though. It's all my money. I'm gonna do it. Whatever. It's not the steel one, that's why. I was gonna say, that one already has an augmentation on it. Alright, we'll put a sharpening augmentation and silver. Maybe one more. Piercing. Yeah, that looks pretty badass. Come and play, show up, Nate. Ready to help? Some scallywags trade between the shops to earn themselves gold. It's you. Know. you. The heart above this person's head. They find you attractive. The more they like you, the bigger the heart becomes. Try flirting, offering gifts, and using other attractive expressions. The more variety, the better. If you work at a relationship, who knows where it could be. Okay. Might be a little old, but hey. Come and play, show right me. Nobody's judging, right? Am I saying it right? Here you go. Wow, a present. Yes, ma'am. Follow me, please. I'll be right there. Okay, let me get a nice expression now. Let's do. 
Do you like my hair? Yes, ma'am, I do. Um Sexy hero pose. Let's I see it's you again. Here, chuck us over the beer, <laughs> <Nice. Ooh. laughs> How many of these have you got? Let's get on with an adventure. You wanna come with me on a mission? To find an ancient sword? And the ladies are all over me in this town. Hello. Hey. Are you busy later? Are you busy later? Wait. Thanks, hero. Wait there. I have to go on a heroic mission. I'm keeping you under surveillance. barrier wasn't there before. It explains what I just found in the guild. Meet me in Maze's quarters. I found a book that may help. To Maze's quarters we go. Something isn't right here. What? No! No! Oh, no! Uh oh. Mama? Do I have to save you again? Not these things. The book! Don't forget the book! Huh. Okay. Jack of Blades. He is known by no one, and he is known by all. He is said to be as ancient as the Old Kingdom, and yet he has the strength of ten heroes. Some say he is not of this world, and has come to excuse me, and has come to us only for the pleasure of death and destruction. Some say he is but a legend, and the mask has covered the faces of dozens over the centuries, all claiming to be the same Jack of Blades. Whatever he is, he prevails in stories and in nightmares, and he is feared even by the guild. Okay, let's take a look at our quest log. This ancient volume describes the forgotten rituals and magic of Hook Coast, including ways of erecting and disabling force fields. It's written in an arcane language you can't decipher. Perhaps the guildmaster will be able to read it. I have a quest card from your mother. Quickly, come to the map room and speak to me. Come in, guildmaster. What can I do you for? Forgot about Dylan. We think we can do a special offer for you, sir. Ah, uh, you don't really have Jack Squat, do you now? You don't have any dark clothing. Come on. What kind of place is this? We got steel, obsidian. Okay, he's got master weapons. Farmers have had stuff stolen. Weird devices they were. Gone. This is terrible. Jack has captured your mother again. 
I spoke to her briefly today. She told me about the sword and the existence of a key to unlock it. Jack can never be allowed to succeed. You must stop him getting the key from Hook Coast. There is a quest card for you, but if you choose to take it, you will forsake your other tasks. This is too important. Well, you take the quest card. If you do, all currently active quests will be abandoned. Yes. Good. Now quickly, give me the Thaumaturgica. When you approach the barrier to Hook Coast Abbey, I shall contact you on your guild seal. If I read from the correct passage, it should disable the barrier. Now go. You've received a new quest card. Can't hurt to have toughness level six, right? Maybe I should start doing some lightning stuff and then use the lightning augments. Spell the barrier at Hook Coast Ruins. Okay. Next quest, I'll start taking some boasts again. I promise. That's annoying and terrifying. I was worried when you disappeared. Your sister. I know. I had to tie her up. Jack is controlling her somehow. That's why I'm here. I'm trying to stop him. He's lying. He's the one working for Jack. No. Huh. She's trying to confuse you. She's... Huh. There is really no time for this, old wizard. Finish the ritual maze. Wow. I'd like my key now. It's almost over, and it will be easier with the boy here. So, you escaped my little cage. I'm surprised it took you so long. I trust you didn't lose too much of that precious blood of yours getting out. We've the been betrayed. 
You've hidden from me far too long. Take our two blood bags to the chamber. I shall be there soon. You gotta be kidding Surprised? me. Man. You shouldn't be. Only an idiot would oppose Jack. Never liked his face paintings, anyways. You can't win, boy. The world belongs to Jack now. You've all. <laughs> What'd you say, old man? <laughs> One, two. Sorry, I heard something in my house. Oh, God. Why do you think I spared you as a child? You've always had your weaknesses. There we go. Now I can target him, finally. Can't do life drain or anything on him. How does that feel, Maisie? Aha! Like some sort of immunity that he's casting. That's right, boy. I guess I have to just try to survive during that.
Where you at, Maze? Let's go, man. Oh, maybe he's down the hill. Silly me. is on top of the tower. There we go. It's time to yeah, just do a little vandalism. Whoa! Can't see anything. Freaking camera. Hope Fable 4 is a little bit better in that department. I can't even see it. Oh, think you could Jack. Come on, Mace. Let's go. you as a child why do you think I spared you as a child I was a see if I can get him inside down here What if you can break that shield? Some good damage now. Out of mana potions, though. I was 
left behind to find you. <laughs> See you, Maze. Oh my god, I spoke too soon. Why do you think I spared you as a child? wrong. Maybe you are strong enough to defeat Jack. <coughs> you haven't got much time. He's using the key to activate the focus sights all over Albion. Then the sword will be his, and it'll be too late. They'll be trying to stop him. None of them can. Oh. You want to know why I did it, don't you? Yes. I suppose I'm just an old coward boy. We don't all embrace death. Easily. For some of us, the quest... The only quest is to escape death. Whatever the cost. And it looks... Like I failed. Goodbye, Maze. Goodbye. Maze's clasp. Okay, now we got a another problem to deal with. Hero, I must see you at the guild. I'm coming, I'm coming. You're back? Things are far worse than I'd feared. Maze's betrayal surprised us all, but we have larger problems. Jack is trying to activate the ancient focus sites across Albion. You must stop him at all costs. I will explain more over your guild seal. Now, step through the Kallis Gate. You've received a new quest card. I'm hoping that I can grow pretty evil. I skipped a lot of side quests. So I'm wondering if uh, I should have done some of them that allowed me to go down the evil route. So we're getting pretty far into the story now. Jack has to be stopped. He's activating those rocks. Always thought they were damn ugly things. I don't want to die for them either. I guess we'll just have to kill them first. Come on, follow the path and turn right. Oh, my God. 
should have got some mana potions. Yeah. like he's done whatever he was doing but the portal is still open follow him through i'll stay here and teach these animals who briar rose is yeah yeah sure why don't you follow him through jack is at the greatwood lake focus site i recall that i'm gonna run through these guys Stopping Jack is first and foremost. There he is. I thought you weren't going to make it. You'll never catch up with me. How do you like the new world? This is just a taste of what's to come, my boy. Just two more to go now. Going as planned right now. Jack is at the Hob Cave focus site. I know, Guildmaster. I'm there right now. Thanks for telling me, though. Chances that he would actually 
let me live right now. After killing his sister, his little sister. You sure you don't want to go right now, huh? Yes or no? Can't have thunder behind me this whole time. It's a risk I'm not willing to take. much of a challenge and now your flesh and blood is waiting for me damn it we're too late he must be at headsman's head that's where everyone else was heading you better go after him i'm exhausted i need to find somewhere to rest To be continued, Thunder. To be continued. Jack has made it to the Gibbet Hill focus site. He must be stopped. I'm trying, Guild Master. I need a little bit of help. Oh god, I hate those things. My least favorite enemy in all of RPGs. guys it's cool to revisit some of the sites that we're at earlier kind of gives you that open world feeling the focus sites are scattered throughout places that we've already been to sweet Scarlet I hope there is still some blood left in those Hard old vein. But look, here comes a fresh supply. Are you ready to see the guild burn, hero? Stop him! Try to stop Jack of Blades. He's activated them all. Oh, you must no. get to the Chamber of Fate in the Guild. The You've received a new quest card. There's nothing we could do. He has power like none I've ever seen. And he has your mother and sister too. If either of them dies, Avo will help us all. Stop him, lad. For all our sakes, stop him. Man, things are just not going right right now. What are you doing out here? Get into the chamber of all right, fate. Alright, alright, alright. Let's hope you might be able to put up a little a little bit more of a fight, Guildmaster. I 
it's the Chamber of Fates. Oh, it's down here. Get into the Chamber of Fate, lad. Oh, I took a. Oops. I looked pretty stupid in front of the Guildmaster right there. Wow, this is beautiful. An oak longbow. Let's take a quick look at that. Minus 40 damage. Oh yeah. The oak weapons are like the first ones that you get. Sounded cool though. What a touching family reunion. The mother, the son, the daughter, and the sword. There's only one thing. Oh my god. It's your blood next. Then I will make this world burn. Now you're gonna get it, Jackie. Nobody kills my mama. You know, it sucks that I don't have any mana potions right now. Alright, let's take care of these guys. Do a little AoE. Time can't hurt. There we go. Generate a little bit. Gotta save it for actually fighting Jack. mana potion too. Oh, yeah. That reminds me of an Elden Ring attack right there. Holy crap. Whoa, targeting. Jeez. Okay. Not a good start. As fast as hell. He should be. Okay. Uh, melee combat doesn't seem to be working, or is it? There we go. Go back to range.
<laughs> That's actually real good right there. Keep them staggered. He's not having it though, is he? are so haunting. Stained glass looks amazing. Oh, okay. Man, I'll hide behind the rock. These things have like a little AOE when they land. It's really hard to dodge. Um, what the hell is that? Like, come on, really? What? I'm gonna get way out of the way. Like, even that's getting me. See if we can actually successfully dodge one of these. Oh, apparently not that. Oh great. Oh man. He's hitting his own guys. Dodge that. That's insane. He's almost dead. Oh man, out of health potions. I spoke of so long ago. Strike me down now with the Sword of Aeons, and you will become as powerful as Jack dreamt of being. Cast it into the Vortex, and its darkness will be gone forever. So what will you do, little brother? The Sword of Aeons. The oldest of all weapons, the Sword of Aeons was blood forged long before the Old Kingdom. Once unlocked, its power is the power of all Elbion. Plus 200 damage, health augmentation, mana, experience, holy crap. Current value on 126,000 gold, and it's a light weapon. Sister. I love you. The power is mine. Jack's Mask. The hero had triumphed over Jack of Blades. The dark power of the sword was his to wield now. Over the months that followed, those who did not already fear him 
learn to do so. His bloodlust seemed boundless. Yet even evil fury ebbs with time. And even the darkest heart requires purpose. News of his deeds faded away. A whole year passed. With Jack gone, Albion returned to something approaching peace. It was the calm before the storm. And unknowingly, the greatest of all heroes waited at its center. We got the Hero, horns now. I'm sorry to disturb you, but we're receiving a message from Scythe, one of our oldest heroes. Yes. We left the guild for the northern wastes long ago, but now... Perhaps it would be best if you came to the boasting platform outside the guild and saw for yourself. Yes, guild master. Yes, the power is ours. Your the horns have begun to grow. To use the middle finger expression. Check, Check the guild you. for more quests. You've received a new quest card. Boy. <laughs> Air guitar. Let's assign, let's assign that to left. And then we'll put middle finger. <laughs> oh, I gotta leave a flirty one. We'll do middle finger on the top. Oi! I like it. I like the way our hero is turning out. I know it's hard for some of you guys to watch, but embrace the darkness. Nobody's left we have in heard my family that Blade's loyal followers are seeking revenge for his death. They have hired a band of highly skilled assassins to kill you. Oh, Be on wow. the lookout for surprise attacks. The Twin Blade. Your prowess as an archer is impressive, hero. You should try your skill at the archery range near Knothole Blade. That was a while ago with Twin Blade. Now there's assassins coming after me. That's cool. Ah, uh, the memories here. This is the bridge we came across right before we saw that our father was dead in Maze. Supposedly was our savior at the time. I was just I was just looking at my twig there. <laughs> I remember fifteen, you. twenty years yes, ago. You. Oh the man was cheating on his wife back here. Ah, it's you, Deathbringer. We could use the help of a hero. Of course, I was hoping for someone like Thunder to come along. But, well, a nasty-looking character like you might be even better. We've been tracking a well-known assassin. A real vicious killer. And he's hiding out in the bandit camp. Of course, we'd never be able to get in, but... Uh, by the looks of you, that snake pit probably feels like oh. Don't worry though, this is more about vengeance than the law. That scumbag killed my brother. There's 1,000 gold waiting for... Can't say I'm surprised. You're probably as much of a rat as he... Well, stay out of trouble. 1,000 gold is an insult. <laughs> oh! Is that your best move? Ow! Stop doing it! Oh. Ow! Ow! Stay out of my way. Oh, 
Oi. Yeah. That's better. You have crimes to pay for. Hand over 40 gold? No. <laughs> Absolutely not. Killing villagers is a very serious crime with a heavy penalty associated with it. Watch out for the guards. I'll let the villagers live. But I dare someone to try to arrest me. <laughs> the sword is awesome. Got a lot of guards coming after me right now. sword. <laughs> Thought I was close to... Oh, I'm not that close. Okay, I'm gonna teleport to the guild. Or actually, I'll teleport to... I'll teleport to... Yeah, I guess the heroes... Yeah. Okay. Heroes go. I'll buy another spell. Let's uh, try out Battle Charge. That looks nice. Force. Turncoat. Turning their target into an unwill. Okay, we'll try that. failed. I will attempt to stop their passage to the mainland. But I require assistance. The strongest among you must open the primal demon door close to this podium. It holds the fire heart. 
Only the chosen one will gain audience with the prophets. Use the heart to call the ship of the drowned. Hurry before all is lost. Sai? Sai! Oh, we've lost him. Scorn! The Demon Door awoke this morning, but none of us could get through. It says we're not worthy. It is up to you, hero. You defeated Jack single-handedly. If it will not open for you... The man's got a point. I'll stick to my speciality and hit the books. We need to know what these summoners are. Good luck. You bear the mask of Jack of Blades. The prophets had foreseen the coming of such a legend among heroes. The rise of the summoners in the northern wastes marks the arrival of a new threat to all things living. We have long dreaded for his portent. Behind my walls lies the Fireheart. There, you will speak to the prophets who watch over it. You may enter now, but beware the beating of the heart. It has burned many before you. We are the prophets of the Fireheart. It was your destiny to seek us out, hero. The beast arises in the frozen north. Only he who claims the heart can stop it. Its mystical powers will guide you across the sea. There you must face a force of such evil. Not even death can silence its fury. Oh, for crying out loud, just tell him to get us out of here. Yes, yes, we were coming to that. To obtain the Fireheart, you must solve the mystery of day and night. And we'll finally be free. Witness the board before you. Each time you turn all the moons into suns, you'll release one of us from our perpetual prison. But fill the board with moons and one of us will perish, and the Fireheart will never be yours. What? I thought you said he'd get it even if he gets us all killed. I heard you. To quiet you, imbecile! Look, it's very simple. Solve the damn puzzle, you get the heart, we get out of this hole, everyone's happy, all right? Turn all the tiles to sun signs to free a prophet. Turn them all to moon signs to kill one. Complete all five rounds to claim your heart. To free each prophet, you must convert all the moon signs into sun signs by walking on them. Turning all the squares and the moon signs will result in a prophet's death. And we'll also solve the puzzle. The fire heart erupts into a powerful flame with every beat of its pulse. If you don't complete the puzzle before the timer runs out, you'll be scorched. Wow. You have begun. chooses well. Thank you, hero. Use the fire heart wisely. Oh, I hope I get out too. Moon to sun. That's good. Sonny! Sonny! Oh, what's happening? The light is so beautiful. M Mother, I'm coming! Excellent! Just free me next, and you can do what you like. That's the one! Now keep going! That's 
I like their commentary. Yes, freedom at last in your face, eternal confinement. You are wise and benevolent, hero. I feel like I want these guys on my side. That's why I'm helping them out right now. Ooh, I screwed up. Uh oh. Ah, a noble move. Uh oh. No, I got it. Careful. You shall be punished. Go, go, go. <laughs> you are a true gentleman. I shall join my fellow prophets now. Cheerio. Cheerio. Good. Just don't mess it up. That's it. Sun signs. Now get on with it. Takes too long. No. Chop, chop. Hurry it up, will you? Come oh on. My Don't God. stop now. Hey, uh, you're not too bad, you know. Uh, I'll send you a postcard sometime. A postcard. The fire heart. So I could have killed all of them. But I'm thinking it might be good to have them on our side for our own personal selfish reasons. You have the fire heart? Excellent. I knew you'd be able to do it. So, have a nice chat with the prophets. I should have known they'd let you in. I've been looking into these summoner creatures and, well, I don't know what you had to do to get the Sword of Aeons, but boy, am I glad you did. These things are bad. I'm sure he'll be able to deal with them, Briar. He did defeat Jack, after all. Your next step is to place the Fireheart in the Hook Coast Lighthouse. Its power will summon the ship that will carry you to the Northern Wastes. Good luck once more, hero. Thank you. I look like a tiefling. You've received a new... Activate the Hook Coast Lighthouse to summon the ghost ship. Please don't mess with the goods.
So this quest doesn't allow me to do a boast. Oh, hero! I've been expecting you. And as you can see, the town's been evacuated, just like the guildmaster asked. Must be something serious, eh? Well, it wasn't easy getting everyone out on such short notice. But us guards know our duty. Well, I could tell you some stories I could. But uh, you probably don't want to hear them right now. I'll just leave it to you, sir. Good day. Place the fire heart in the lighthouse. This is where May is perished. Books, the ship should arrive as soon as the heart's energy reaches full power. What the hell? A summoner. It's trying to destroy the heart. We have to... We have to protect it. Come on, we have to stop it before it destroys the fire heart. We've got company. <laughs> Oh my god, I came so close to death right there. So close. So many freaking guys around here, this is nuts. Oh man. 
this is going to be difficult. This is going to be real difficult. Here's your ride. Looks, uh, cozy. When you get to the Northern Wastes, your guild seal will activate the local teleporters, and I'll be able to join you. Scythe would have done it long ago, but he destroyed his seal before he arrived. Didn't want Maze to know what he was up to, I guess. Well, have a nice trip. Maybe when I see you next, we can have a snowball fight. Funny. The strange, silent ship set sail into the featureless swell. Day after day, it carved its path among the waves, an ocean phantom moving ever forward. Then the moment came when icy peaks speared out of the horizon mist. These were the shores of the Lost Bay. The northern wastes lay beyond them. Wish we actually got to ride the ship. The ship of the drowned. Looks the same as the Hook Coast. Hey, look at our beard. Epic. Welcome to the Northern Wastes, Guildsman. I had feared you lost. I am Scythe, though my name has long been forgotten in the Guild. Maze saw to that. My apologies for not meeting you in person. I must remain in Snowspire Village and protect it from summoners. Terrible though they are, they are but a symptom of a much greater power rising in these lands. Meet me in Snowspire in the far north. I will explain everything, and then we must consult the town's ancient oracle. I pray we can awaken it. And that it holds the answers we seek. You've received a new quest card. Activate the Snowspire Oracle. Meet Scythe in Snowspire. Okay. Hey, the teleporters are up and running. Nice one. I'm going to have a look around after speaking to Scythe. Catch you later.
little dance right there. Creatures of the North. from these creatures. how to uh, charm these creatures doing something wrong with that spell I just heard somebody over here. Apparently not. Health augmentation. Nice. I already have one on my current sword, but... I'll be back. Don't you worry. Oh, man. Come <laughs> on. 
There's always a chest at a dead end. Orkhan's club, often mista mistaken for a hob, and sometimes as a baby troll, Orkhan was a diminutive warrior who shunned society and lived in the mountains. So how was the cruise? Me? I'm more of a teleporter girl. Good thing your seal set the local ones off. I've managed to get a good look around and this pile of stones might be worth investigating. See all those inscriptions? I'm heading back to the guild to work on the translations. You should carry on to Snowspire and speak with Scythe. He's waiting for you. Catch you later! Goodbye. Snow Spire Village. Everybody's staring at me. Welcome to Snow Spire, hero. Walk with me. Speak of your journey. Summoners have reached Hook Coast. Then there is less time than I thought, and I have much to tell you. I arrived here many years ago, when the guild believed Jack of Blades would use the Snowspire Oracle in his search for the sword. Now it is we who are in need of its wisdom. To speak with it, we will need the glyphs of inquiry. They were hidden in the Age of Archon by four acolytes who buried them deep in the haunted necropolis. I will send word to the necropolis guards to grant you passage. Any of you guys that have been watching this entire Let's Play, let me know below in the comments. I really appreciate it. Uh, over time, I'll probably, you know, develop my own style for these types of videos. I'm not used to doing Let's Plays, so I wasn't really sure how I wanted to handle it, you know, in terms of being chill, being entertaining, uh, or barely talking. There's several different styles to do it. Thank you guys for watching. All right, let's go. Uh, let's go activate activate the Snow Spire Oracle. Go to the Necropolis and recover the tablets containing the glyphs that will awaken the Oracle. Might stop at the tavern for a few brewskis real fast. Don't like this. <laughs> the hell are you looking at? Oh! <laughs> Must you be like that, hero? <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's a new uh, expression that I got. It's an alignment expression. Alright, hopefully I don't mess up the controls here. I took a day off from Fable and I was playing Timesia. Very different from this game. Hello, can I get some service around here? Shut up. <laughs> Ready to help? Okay. Let's see what this guy has. Beer. I'll take ten. Thank you. If I can sell him anything. The tavern. Marvelous, isn't it? Coin golf. Ah. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, but I don't get it. <laughs> 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 I gave her a beer. <laughs> Alright, let's drink some beer. Oh, I gave it away again? Hold on. Produce. Give me some beer. Beer. Use. Well, let's assign let's assign it to uh left. And let's take a sip. Hold on. 
There we go. I was just too close to people. Excuse me, sir. I'm having a couple drinks. I am not an alcoholic. Oh, yes, that's it. Uh, I'll have a large <laughs> mead. Oh. Just, just, well, <laughs> don't make it large. <laughs> too much fun in Snowspire. How you ladies doing? All right, hold on. I'm having too much fun. Let's go. Uh, let's, let me grab another alignment. We'll grab middle finger, tap dance, cross sack dance. Uh, let's go with. We'll go with the. We'll go with middle finger. Put that one on the left. Okay, there we go. Excuse me. See you later, losers. Oi. <laughs> you know, I cut out a lot of the shenanigans out of the Let's Play. In the future, maybe I won't do that. It's kind of a kind of a big part of Fable, the expressions and stuff. And I haven't really shown too much of that, so so I apologize. But I'm also trying to cram everything into one video, one video that's under 12 hours. So I'm a little bit pressed for time. Oh, wrong button. See, there we go. Oh no, I'm barfing. <laughs> I guess I deserve it. I deserve it. Oh man. Yeah, oh, man, see, I just playing one, a different game for one day has really uh, messed me up. I'm trying to attack with R1. But it's square on my controller for Fable. I think I got the hang of it again. The Fable controls are already weird as it is. They're not very modern type controls. I probably should have gone with the Fable 2 and 3 controls. Alright, we gotta go... Actually, let me check down here for a chest. Oh, I already got that chest. Okay. Here we go. The Northern Foothills. I don't think there was a closer teleport for myself for this quest. Could be wrong, though. Oh, there we go. Perfect. Microphone check. Okay. Oh, Hello. yes. So I told us to let you in. Well, I guess you better shine through. Yeah. Nice try, Mungo. It's your turn, and you know it. Ah, oh, nuts. All right then, follow me. Right, that's as far as I'm going. This place ain't safe, you know. The old town's full of ghosts. Folks say the poor beggars don't even realize they're dead. Anyway, take care looking for them, um, glyphs, they're called, right? You're not the first one that's come rummaging for pieces of carved stone, you know. The others found more than they bargained for, though. Rotting corpses, a lot of them now. Anyway, have a nice day. See ya. 
Go to the necropolis and recover the tablets containing the glyphs that will awaken the oracle. Whoa. A sign, friend of sight, but not as good at staying alive. Clever. Nice, I needed some, you know, I should have bought some stuff in Snow Spire. Forgot to get more health potions and willpower potions. Demon Relic, a tablet with no discernible expression. The cursed tablet crumbles to dust in your hand, releasing a noxious odor and summoning several creatures around you. Sounds exactly like a lightsaber. Tablet containing the glyph of inquiry crumbles in your hand, but not before you learn Yaren's expression. Will potion. Cool. 25 silver keys. Yeah, I've been slacking on the silver key game. That's going to be for a separate playthrough. If I can find the time, I might do another playthrough and do a good playthrough. Maybe stream it and uh, take my time with the silver keys and everything. I hear a bell ring. Nice. Excuse me, Mr. Werewolf. I'm just gonna be on my way. Excuse me, guys. Ooh, look at this. Grave digger. I wonder if that's a title. Summoners. things are everywhere. The 
big one over there too. Just so beefy in the legs. Hello, sir. I keep pressing circle to dodge because of the game I was playing yesterday. <laughs> Kidding me. I need that assassin's lunge blink. <laughs> sounds like the you uh, have reached legendary status. Sounds like the troll in Lord of the Rings when they're in the mines of Moria. mana. Forgot I have those other spells too.
Let's see if I can get. Oh, there's a dead end. Crap. I got a bunch of graves that I have to do back here. The tablet containing the glyph of inquiry crumbles, but not before you learn Kaloran's expression. The anniversary edition does look... I haven't looked at a side-by-side, -side, but it definitely feels like it looks much better than the original. It's just a shame that the movement's a little clunky and they couldn't clean up the controls a little bit. I mean, I guess they did with the Fable 2 and 3 inspired, but... Unfortunately, I'm not using that. Uh-oh. these guys real fast because I haven't used that yet. It's pretty crazy. <laughs> Alright, screw it.
No, Your health no. is critical. Your health is critical. You have died. Fortunately, you are carrying a resurrection file. These shatter when you die, bringing you to life again instantaneously. It's the first time I've had to use a resurrection file. Um, I was already pretty bad at the controls to begin with. They just feel awkward on my PlayStation 5 controller. And now that I uh, played Timesia for 8 to 10 hours yesterday, <laughs> I'm super bad. But it's okay, we're having fun. It's cool to see this uh, resurrection file in action. I think I have a ton of those. Watch what I'm backing up into here. There we go. What to say? Guy has a lot of HP. Okay. Um, I can probably summon back. Let me just check one thing. Or teleport back. Okay. Cool. Sorry, 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 guys. Can I Again, Dark One. Ready to help? Best prices. With Coin Golf. Play it here. Coin Golf. Uh, I might actually have to try that out. I've got my eye. I have to say, your face is. Please don't mess with the goods. Show off your trophy. 16 witnesses available. Here we go. Yeah. You guys like that? Apparently they don't. Zero people saw your trophy. Oh, you failed to beat your high score of zero. Oh, okay.
Let's go talk to Scythe. You have uncovered the glyphs. Very good. It Very is good. Time you awoke the Oracle from its deathly slumber. From its deathly slumber. Oh, great Oracle, grant us the knowledge we seek. What evil rises in this land? The prophecy is fulfilled. The guildsman is here. You follow the footsteps of the one who bore the mask you carry. Jack of Blades has awakened the dormant power of the summoners. He has used the blood of your family to feed his new shell beyond the bronze gate. But now his soul mask is in your hands. You must use it to feed the Archon's shrine and open the gate. Okay. Go now and face your destiny. So Jack has cheated death once more. Never have we encountered a being like him. I do not envy you. The Bronze Gate has long been a symbol of doom in this land. Return to Briar Rose at the Shrine. Perhaps she can tell you how to use Jack's soul mask. I must return to the guild. May fate smile on you. Hey, you don't gotta talk though. You don't gotta talk like that, man. Interesting, interesting. To interact with the Oracle, use one of the four glyph expressions. Okay, to open the Bronze Gate, you must gather three hero souls, matching the descriptions in Archon's Shrine, which is directly east of Snowspire. Um, what color is the potion shop in this town? What is this? Hold on. Hello. You are spectacularly a Would you like to trade? Wages must be paid for. You chose power, not your sister's life. The hell did you just say? Excuse me. Say it one more time. Oi! You know, you're really not impressing me. It's your lucky day. wig <laughs> right plate chess piece nothing too good in here you triumphed you really did thank you thank you thank you and off we go hey glad you're still with us these inscriptions are fascinating you know everything indicates that Jack's new form will emerge from behind the bronze gate and this structure is the key to opening it. But it looks like it'll take the souls of three heroes to activate the mechanism. These things are never simple, are they? It doesn't want just any heroes either. The first instruction calls for the king of the arena, no less. Hello, hello. I suppose you could chop your own head off, but then there'd be no one for me to order around, would there? Why don't you pay Thunder a visit? He knows the arena inside and out. I've checked with the guild and they say he's a not whole glade. Okay. You've still got Jack's mask, haven't you? Good. You'll need it to trap the souls. I still can't believe he might not be dead. Anyway, I better start researching the second inscription. Uh, ma'am? You, 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 you do know that I killed Thunder's sister. I'm back, and our business is not quite finished. You okay. took my sword, remember? Yes, I do, Have Jackie. You any idea how many centuries I spent looking for it? But its work is done. Soon I will have power beyond your imagining, and you will be the first to die. 
what the last Jack said. And look where I stand. Okay, we do have to go to Knothole Glade, but I'll stop at the Heroes Guild real fast. See how the guild master's doing. Long time no see. Hi. You know, maybe I'll give the summon one a try. Assassin Rush is the cool one. But I always took that one, like, immediately when I was younger and playing this game. So I'm, like, I'm trying to be different, you know? But it's really good, though. Alright, I'll take it. And I'll level it up. Cool. I believe you will find thunder in not whole good. Watch him. Yeah, you better watch out. Look at these guys. you again we don't need a hero for the first time in years we aren't being attacked sieged or kidnapped by anything thanks to me now leave us alone thunder we meet again you briar rose said you would come i will tell you what i know if it will get you out of my sight we were both once called kings of the arena but there have been many heroes in the past who have claimed that name you should search in the bloody dust of the arena itself they say the souls of past champions haunted resting in the place of their greatest achievement now go unless you're here to take my soul just as you took my sister why go all the way to the arena you have a perfectly good soul right in front of you. And you've already killed Jack. his sister. Shut the hell up and I'll make decisions on my own. Thunder, you're soft, man. You're soft. I killed your sister. And you've let me live twice now after seeing you. And I don't respect that. I must put an end to your bloodline. Ha <laughs> ha oh, shit. Oh, man. Oh, I forgot to target him. Oh, no. Now I look like an idiot. Should I let him live after that? Not a chance. So be it. I have waited for this moment too long. Now I can give him an honorable death. Kill Thunder and collect his soul. I can't let Thunder live when I'm doing an evil playthrough, you know what I'm saying?
Guy's got a good block. I'll give him that. Jack telling me what to do right now. This is my evil playthrough, not Jack's. That was easy. I hope this thing works. We need to release the soul from the mask, and, well, your guess is as good as mine. <gasps> was that Thunder Soul? That's not exactly what I had in mind when I sent you to him. <laughs> anyway, we figured out the second inscription. It says, The Heroine. I can't think of anyone who fits the description better than Scarlet Robe, your mother. There's always me, of course, but as you can see, I'm still alive, and I plan to stay that way. You'll have to pay her tomb in Oakvale another visit. I know this won't be easy, but Scarlet was always one to make sacrifices, remember? Okay. Might stop at the Glade real fast, actually. Hasn't she suffered enough? Would you really do that to your own mother? Take Briar. She is of no use to anyone. I've got my eye on you. Man. Tough quest, isn't it? I've got my eye on you. Look at my little tiefling horns. But the general goods vendor. I love how everybody's just running. I think this might be the guy. Nope. Oh. <laughs> oh, here he is. It's Clay. Please don't mess with the goods. I will take ten health potions and another ten. Eight will potions. And then I'm going to sell you... Apparently nothing. I have seven resurrections. We'll sell a couple of those. I have ten more potions too. I don't have to come back. Okay. I can't believe it. After centuries... You know, I'm thinking about my decision right now, and even if I am evil, it doesn't mean I don't love my mother. Now, my sister is a different case here, but my mother is so precious to me. So I've got a better plan. I've got a change of plans. This is going to be the most good evil thing you guys have ever seen.
Oh, Briar. Where are you? Three, two, one. Well, I'm rather fond of my soul. I'm not giving it up without a fight. Okay, okay, okay. Not quite sure what the uh, what the good or evil play here would be. Probably more evil to kill Briar, right? She's still alive. Illusion, a coward's trick. Only one of them is real. Perfect spell for the occasion. The combat's quite fun in this game. Um, it's not obviously not the best combat system ever, but it but it is really fun. She deserves to die. And the impact feels really good when you actually connect. <laughs> See ya, Briar. Inscription says now. I didn't think about that, Jackie. Ah, the oldest soul. Oh no. Wow. The guild no. master would be a perfect choice. <laughs> oh, I'm going to enjoy this. Oh my god. could try to find out whose soul could take its place. To be quite honest with you, I'm disappointed in the Guildmaster for letting Jack take over and burn the guild on that encounter several hours prior. And the old man's been kind of pissing me off lately. It is unfortunate that you chose Ryan's death. I shall journey to the shrine. My decision has been made. I cannot spare the time to seek rumors and hidden messages. I must kill. I must kill. Oh, welcome back, sir. This place has been a mess since you left. People running around with bits of old paper, books flying everywhere. And a guild master's only gone and hold himself up in the guild woods. We're not supposed to let anyone near him. We found it. The soul mentioned in the inscription. It must be Nostro. 
His soul has been trapped in the Litchfield graveyard for centuries. Our texts suggest it should be in the graveyard circle, you know, where you found the tunnel to Bargate Prison. Catching souls? Never heard such nonsense. Well, good luck, hero. Now, there could be a way to RP this in an evil way that makes sense, as opposed to just killing the Guildmaster, and perhaps in a future evil playthrough. I'll probably do a lot of evil Let's Play playthroughs, because not a lot of people do the evil path. And it's nice to show a different side of the game, a little bit of the player agency. But uh, in the future, I'll try to RP it a little bit better, even if it's uh, an RP that I'm making up outside of the game. Yeah, Nostro's soul from the graveyard circle just... It's too goody two-shoes. We must take out the guild master. I must do what has to be done. Because if I'm not going to do it, who's going to do it? <laughs> Stop there, hero! Do not come any closer! Excuse me? I still remember the night you were brought to us, man. I knew even then what great potential you had, what great thing you would accomplish. Such a pity it has to end like this. Don't you see Jack is using you to destroy the guild? I can't allow you to do this. Gods! He didn't even know if I was going to kill him yet. I simply came to the woods and killed a few guards on the way. So you know what? I do not regret my decision to take out the guildmaster. Epic fight. Damn, this dude just sapped my mana. I might have to go after him in a second. I'm invi invincible right now. Oh, 
When Maze betrayed me, I knew he was a coward. But you, you are the biggest disappointment of all. You've been deceived twice over. You have over. been given too much power, and it has corrupted you. But it isn't too late to turn back. Stop this now, and there is still hope for you, for all of us. Please, let me teleport you to the graveyard. Take Nostro's soul instead. Wow, this is harder to do than I... than I thought. But Guildmaster, you are a disgrace. Very well, hero. Do your worst. I am no defenseless old man. Ah, the memories. I have powers that you can't begin to... <laughs> wow. <laughs> I didn't know that was going to happen. I do it for you guys. The guild master's death was an unnecessary sacrifice, but now have the final soul you must return to the shrine nearing the end of the game Jack's presence growing stronger. The stench of death is overpowering. You will do well to prepare yourself before facing him. The inscriptions indicate that only one hero may pass through the gate. You must face him alone. May death close his eyes to you. A mistake, uh... You're too late, little hero. Once more, too late. Come to the Bronze Gate. We have unfinished business. Trust me, I know, Jack. Trust me. that bald spot the horns are growing so big I've got hair loss nobody said the path of evil is pretty competitor You could look up.
Look for the shadow. Look for the shadow. Shut the hell up, Scythe. The power is mine. I told you I could not be killed so easily, hero. <laughs> Say what? The dragon was slain, and yet a tremor ran through the world. Skies darkened, and every man, woman, and child in Albion succumbed to a petrified hush. The hero and Jack of Blades were one. 
what chaos and pain they would bring, none could say. Yet here our tale must end. And what happened to the guild and its heroes? That is a story for another time. And that concludes our adventures for Fable Anniversary. Jack is a tough one to crack, that's for sure. I'm actually very interested in going back and trying not only just a good playthrough, but also mixing it up a little bit. Like at the end right there, not putting the mask on and seeing what happens. So going evil two thirds of the game and then the final third going good and stuff like that. But thank you guys so much for watching this very, very long video. If you guys like Let's Plays like this, please let me know below in the comments and I will be sure to do some more. I really enjoy doing this type of content. It's a lot, of course, it's a lot easier than doing regular videos and researching and script writing and stuff. So yeah, thank you guys very much. And if you're new around here, make sure to check out the channel. I do all sorts of types of content on this channel, ranging from guides to lore videos, to live streams, to D&D narrations and more. You guys have a good one.